Hello, everybody, and welcome to Oros. This is a a new game that is. Uh, I I don't think it's even officially released yet. Tee hee hee, tee hee. Yeah, it's gonna be released in about an hour, I think. But uh, this is a new puzzle game that's coming out today, and I was very. Oh, I need to stay tabbed in the game. Oops. I was I was very generously offered a key to this game to play it on stream. And as soon as I saw it was like a really cool looking puzzle game, I was immediately just, yes, yes, I will play this. When's it coming out? Uh, May 22nd? Let me add that to my calendar. <laughs> just immediately like, I, I will play this on release day. I'm very looking forward to this. This game looks really like really chill really relaxing i keep clicking out because i'm silly i'm a silly silly bean there we go <laughs> but uh, it looks really really lovely i'm looking forward to checking this game out but also uh, i apologize in advance i'm a, a little bit scattered today already i'm kind of all over the place i don't know what i'm doing <laughs> but thankfully because of this game being like more of like a chill vibes kind of game I don't think it's going to require too much like super big braining right out of the gate like I can imagine it getting a bit trickier later on with the, the mechanics but I think it should be okay to start with like <laughs> give me a bit of time to warm up and actually start functioning as a human being <laughs> But uh, welcome in, everybody. Rika, congratulations on the first. Welcome, welcome. And Suzume, thank you for the confetti as well. Welcome, welcome. How's it going? Oh, that's how it's going. It's going hydrate. Thank you for the hydrate as well. Yes, let's, let's start in style. Let's start in a way that will truly help to wake me up before I go-go. You stayed up until 4 a.m. playing Twofold. <laughs> oh, I'm so glad. I'm so glad to hear it. I I saw that you were you you got so invested you started just doing Millie's route entirely, and I'm I feel very, very proud. I'm very glad. I'm very glad that you're you're playing it and enjoying it. I'm I'm so glad you like it. It's it's such a good game. I've been having so much fun with it. I'm really excited for next Tuesday now as well. <laughs> I've got so many things to look forward to with streaming now. Like, I'm always looking forward to Outer Wilds. I'm always looking forward to Twofold. Twofold Tuesday. I'm really looking forward to Divinity on Friday because we kind of floundered around a bit for our first stream of it. But I think with getting the hang of things, we just have to, like, find people. I think we just have to actually talk to people. Which is a little difficult with the having to be like nearby to eavesdrop and actually click on the person instead of having the auto eavesdrop like Baldur's Gate 3. That would be a really nice quality of life addition if they added it later in the game, but I don't think they would for a game that came out in like 2015. Was it 2015 for the announced edition of Divinity Original Sin? I think around then. Something like that. <laughs> but yeah, I'm very excited for, for everything I'm playing at the moment. And I've been really excited for this, too, because I was told about the game, like, quite a while ago now. And I've been, I've just been waiting to play it, because I wanted to wait until release day. I clicked off again, why do I keep... I keep clicking away from the game instinctively. And then the really nice, uh, comfy, ambient background music stops, and I'm like, no, I made a mistake. <laughs> but uh, I'm really looking forward to playing this, though, it looks really nice. But yes, from what I've gathered from the, the store page for this game, it's all about like drawing curves. Like, woo. Like infinity symbols and loops and making things go around in a loop in the right order. And it looks so pretty. It looks really nice. I'm excited. Also, Ace, hello. Welcome, welcome. How's it going? How are you doing? Happy Wednesday. Welcome to Comfy Puzzling. I think it's going to be a very chill game, though. It looks it looks really chill. But yeah, let's let's just do a level to see 
What's going on? Okay, I guess this is the first level. You get like little handles and then you've got to adjust it to make it go through all of the points. <gasps> I already love this. I already love this. This is great. Tap. And then we go to the next one. <gasps> this is so pretty. I love the sounds. Haha. <laughs> I think the hardest part is gonna be making sure you use the right handles to, to move things in the right way. I made like a squashed egg in that one. <laughs> oh, you're working, just finished lunch. Oh, I hope you had a good lunch break. Hopefully the rest of the workday goes very smoothly and easily. I'm wishing you the best, but thank you for stopping in. I hope you have a, I was gonna say, I, I hope you have a good work day. I, I hope you have a, an easy work day, I think, is more the sentiment I want to share. <laughs> oh, this one has three. Do we even need three? Kind of. We kind of do need three. Ooh, okay. Yeah, there we go. Oh, now we pull this further back. There we go. Got him. We got him. Looks like a like a rocket. About to shoot off into the stars. Well, this seems easy enough. Yeah, look at that! Another squashed egg. Oh, this is this is really nice. I like this. Ah, oh, just making games most days are fun and easy. Oh, that's the best. But uh, I, I know game dev can still be kind of stressful sometimes too. So the, the sentiment still, still remains. I hope it is. It continues to be fun and easy. <laughs> oh, I'm going the wrong way around. Oh, I'm so silly. Ha ha ha. I gotta do it like that. I did not pay attention to the direction it was going in. Thank you for teaching me that game. <laughs> I really love the little bloops. The little bloops in this game are so... Like, listen to that. I love the bloops. What is... What is this about? Like, does it like have to go along the path? I'm going the wrong way. Why did I do that? <gasps> yeah, you've got to get all of the ones along the way as well, then, I guess. That one's a really good egg shape. That was a really good egg shape. <laughs> it's only stressful when the designers get involved. I see. I see. Yeah, the, the actual, like, coding and figuring things out part is probably more straightforward. Design has a lot more, like, personal taste and nuance and things that can be slightly different, I guess. And Gambler, hello! Welcome, welcome! Welcome on in, how's it going? Oh, the way the sound cues are part of the music reminds you of Flower. I've never actually played Flower. Maybe I should check that out. There's there's quite a few games that I, I recognize the names of and I'm always like, oh, I wanted to check that out. But I've never gotten around to it because I am me. Oh, <laughs> uh, it's mostly too warm, you're melting. Oh no, ah, uh, I know that feeling. Thankfully, it's not as warm as it has been over here, but I'm definitely warmer than I would be comfortable with at the moment. I mean, the worst was like a week and a half ago. Like, a week and a half ago, that whole weekend was an absolute nightmare here. I was I was so hot. I, I just wasn't functioning anymore. 
but thankfully it's it's more livable today. I, I want to go back to winter though. I want to be back in the middle of winter. I like the cold. Ah, so this is like one, two, whoop, 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 three. It's going the right way. Yeah, I think something like that. Yeah, look at that. I did it. I really like this. This is so fun. I, lo I love the... There's actually so much more thought that, that goes into the puzzles than I thought there would be. When I saw like the, the figure of eights and the loops and stuff, I thought it was going to be really easy and straightforward. But that it, it does actually make you think, even from like the first area. And there's how many? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. It's 11 areas as well. And this one has considerably more than the first one. So this is this has got more in it than I thought it thought it would. Hold on. Before I do anything else, I'm gonna tap out just for a second. Because I wanna post a link as well to the store page for this game. It's not released yet. But it's going to be released in like about an hour or so. <laughs> gonna be released in maybe an hour i think it, it says in approximately an hour to me so i'm that's what i've been going off <laughs> i don't know exactly knowing steam it could in an hour it could then change to uh like 58 minutes like and then it's actually two hours i don't know how steam approximate times work but either way i was given permission to play this on May 22nd, so that, <laughs> I'm playing it technically a little, little bit before the game comes out. I think it's an hour global. No, I, I mean like the fact that on the Steam page it says unlocking in approximately an hour, but it still said that like half an hour ago, so <laughs> I don't know when that hour is, and I don't know if it's going to be in an hour it just unlocks, or if in an hour it will then change to 59 minutes and become more specific. Because I've seen some things that do that. <laughs> I like when it has, like, the time and not just, like, in this amount of time. Because it's something that I um, I, I realized with... Because I've been playing a mobile game recently called AFK Journey. And I was playing that and it said, new season out in one day. So I was really excited for like the the day before and I was waiting until reset at midnight and then well it's it's like 1am for me I think the midnight the 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 reset afk journey yeah I've I've been kind of hooked on afk journey <laughs> I really like that game hi Kunie and hi Akire as well thank you for the reset for 32 months oh my goodness that's so long that's so, such a long amount of time. Thank you so much. Thank you for the resub. Welcome, welcome. Also, TJM, hello. Welcome. Oh, I remember playing this game when it was a game jam game in Ludum Dare. It was nice, but it wasn't clear where the game could go. It's nice they turned it into a full game. Yeah, I'm so glad as well. Yeah, because I was looking into the game when, when I got the email about it. And realized like as it that it started like as a game jam game and i was i was wondering like how in depth it would be like how far you could take the puzzles in it but already just with the the first area i think i can see how this can get really complex quite easily in a fun way so i'm really excited <laughs> But yeah, I was really excited for AFK Journey, the new season, because I'd, I'd basically like maxed out everything in the game. I was just waiting for the season. And it said, uh, new season in one day. So I waited up for the daily reset. And then as the daily reset happened, it said, new season in 23 hours. And I was like, well, that's two days then. Why did you say one day? Why did you say it was being released in one day when it was not? <laughs> so now I never trust approximate times if they're not super specific i 
I don't know what they mean. <laughs> but uh, but I, I do understand that it's it's safer to do it that way because of time zones and being like, well, if this game releases at 3 p.m., what is that in other time zones? So it does make sense, but I, I don't know when this game's coming out, but it is today. <laughs> And it's it's really charming so far. It's so relaxing. It's really, really nice. Also, thank you for the hydrate. I will have a sip of my monster. And return to chill puzzling. I'm I really love the vibes of this game. It's so comfy. It's so calming to play. I love it. Wazzle Wednesday uh, Huh? That's a new one. Hi, Timochi. <laughs> welcome, welcome. How's it going? I guess we've got a relaxing, relaxing Wednesday. Oh, it's a puzzle, but with a W, so it's a wuzzle. I was, I don't know why. In my mind, I was thinking like fuzz, fuzzy. I, I read wuzzle and my brain was thinking of fuzzy things. So I, <laughs> I don't know why my brain went in that direction, but. Wuzzle Wednesday. All right, here we go. Yeah, that's straightforward enough. I love the sounds. The sound design is so spot on. All right, that was that was very straightforward. What are you setting me up for? <gasps> they can't go in the red. Okay. So we're gonna have to go like this. Oh, look at that! Right, is that gonna be too close to the red? I don't think it will. Yes, we're good. We got it. Ah. Oh. I had to make it into a squished triangle shape instead. And now it's branching. Oh, let's go, let's go this one first. It's like a straight line, hold on. Go like that, super stretched out. Will that do it? I think that will do it. Yeah, look at that. Making it very long. And then this one? Oh, because I need to get that one as well. Okay, I think this is going to be like... Make it huge. There we go, we've got a, a large one there. <laughs> Stretch it out. I could just continue only doing one of these, but you know me, I'm I'm never gonna leave a puzzle unsolved. Yeah, they're going the wrong way around. Oh wait! You can right click to make it go the other way. Oh that's that's handy. That's very handy. Now I don't have to move everything around. Yeah. Oh you like how fluid all the movement is. Oh me too. Everything flows. In such a satisfying way. It's it it reminds me of those like the oddly satisfying videos you can find. Oh well, like the ones that you used to be able to find. I feel like nowadays there's loads of videos that are labeled as oddly satisfying, and then it's just like a person cleaning a rug using loads of chemicals and too many cleaning supplies, and it's clearly a rug that somebody had just dumped a bunch of dirt on and it's not satisfying at all. Uh, I'm 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 not mad. I'm I'm I might be a bit mad. I'm mad at those videos. <laughs> but I, I I used to watch a lot of like oddly satisfying. Like you'd see like a production line or something, and it it would just flow so beautifully. And I always love seeing that kind of thing. Like it it makes me feel accomplished. Oh no, I do have to do both of them to unlock it, because it's a two-part thing. I didn't look at it before. I mean, good job I'd be doing that anyway, right? Right, 
Okay, this is going to be interesting. How am I going to squish this to be the right shape that I need it to be? If I do something like this and then squish it down. I don't know how to get the, the four in here. <gasps> Wait. Oh. <gasps> oh, no, I do know. We're getting to the we're getting to the infinity loops now. We're getting to the loops. This is what I was excited for. This is what I was excited for seeing the the teasers and the promo art for the game. This is what I've been waiting for. Look at this. Here we go. We got the loops. We got the loops. Oh, that's satisfying. Oh, it's so nice. Wait, it's Sisame. You're so right. Wind down Wednesday. I love that. I love that so much. Oh, I reminded you of the ceramic bowl staining glob. What? I'm sorry, the what? I'm... <laughs> Cera like, I've, I've seen some, like, ceramic bowl staining with, like, a pit of water and then it's, like, dipped in and then pulled out again and it's got, like, the, the color on it. Do you mean that? Okay, this one needs two, but there's three branches, but I'm going to do all three of them anyway. <laughs> oh, there were videos of like a stretchy glob with paint staining ceramics. I I don't think I've seen any of that. I've somehow managed to miss that along the way. What? I'm I'm so intrigued now. Hold on. Give me a second. I'm sorry. I'm I'm really curious now. Uh One second. Liri will <laughs> resume shortly. I need to figure out what this is. I need to try and find something. I'm seeing people making a ceramic bowl, like, on a pottery wheel. That's not what you mean, like, I, I don't know. I don't even know what to Google to try and find this. <laughs> I've just been Googling random keywords and I found an article from The Cut labeled, Will the Millennial Aesthetic Ever End? That's not what I'm looking for. Oh, I think I found it! No, that's someone holding a pear above a bowl. Never mind. I have no idea how to look for this. I will look it up afterwards, I think. <laughs> yeah, uh, like like a stretchy glob with paint staining. Like, I, I, I feel like I can imagine in my mind what you mean, but I cannot find anything at the moment. I think I'm going to have to deep dive into that after the stream because I if 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 I start going down this rabbit hole now, I'm never going to get back out again. But I am so intrigued now. I'm I don't know how I've managed to miss that along my journeys. I just end up with the horrible things where I'm like I'm expecting a satisfying video and then I get someone like shaving a bar of soap and it's like this is not satisfying. <laughs> This is just uh, soap shavings. This is not satisfying to me. But no, the things I like are like the things where it's like really neat painting or it's like a mechanical production line and everything just flows through perfectly. Like those kind of videos fill me with such a like a sense of satisfaction. Like I, I watch them and I'm like, everything is working as it should be. It's so satisfying. But I feel like it's... People, people just make them, like, purposely not satisfying on purpose to drum up attention. <laughs> to get people in the replies saying, this isn't satisfying at all, and I miss when it was actually satisfying videos all the time. But it's okay, I just moved on to cat videos instead. Cat videos can never go wrong. Anyway, this is genuinely satisfying, though. I love this. Oh, look at all these blobs. I'm gonna have to loop around them. <gasps> I know how I'm going to do the loop. It's going to be big loop, 
into a smaller loop. I just need to make that. So I start like down here. And go like, like this, I need to make this bigger. I'm getting the hang of this, look at that. I got the loop, I, I really like this. Wait, I think this is actually the loop of um, <laughs> the image I used for my thumbnail for this stream. <laughs> it's that one, hold on. Hold on, let me find the, the thumbnail I made for the stream today. Let me show that very, very quickly. Here, this is the thumbnail I made. I, I, I found like the press kit for the game. <laughs> and just picked a shape that I thought looked nice. It was that one, it was that level. I did it. I, I definitely did not have the green handle up there though. I did it in a, in a different order to that, but I made the same shape. Oh, that's so cool. <laughs> oh, you found one, you put it in share things. Oh, thank you, hold on. Hold on, sorry. I'm I'm so curious about this now. It's okay. See, what I'm actually doing is I'm buying time for the game to be released before I play too much of it. It's <laughs> I'm str strategically stretching it out. Oh my goodness, I have seen one of these! Hold on, hold on. Okay, I'm going to I'm going to show this on stream very quickly if I can remember how I did anything. If I can remember <laughs> how to stream. I don't remember I don't remember how to be a streamer. Hold on. Here it is. Welcome back to this US oh, Open Office. Oh, sorry. You've changed some of your settings. Thank you. This is great. Um Got it. Miller just uh, left. Not, sponsored, not sponsored, not sponsored. I, I don't. Here. I think I have seen stuff like that. Oh no! Now that I'm seeing it, I've I've seen this before. I love this. I love this so much. This this. Yeah, this is this is satisfying to me. That is perfect. Oh, I don't know what that is, but the the banging pots are not <laughs> not what I'm looking for. But oh, now that now that I've seen it, I've I have seen something like that before. That that is yes, I like that. I like that. That that's satisfying content to me. That I love those. I love that kind of thing. They they just like it. Just it's so perfect it's so nice and it's so efficient too it's just like back and forth and every single one is just spot on i love those thank you thank you susan thank you for my life thank you very much i'm gonna have a, a free monster hee <laughs> But yeah, thank you, thank you so much for finding that for me. Because I was, I was so curious. My, I couldn't think what it was. But no, I think I have seen those before. So thank you, thank you. I don't have to wonder anymore. <laughs> All right, let's have a look at this one. Oh, that little dot down there. Oh, I guess the dots don't have to be gotten in a specific order. Is that how they work, maybe? Like, what if I do something like this? No, I, I need this to be like a really big wide loop, I think. Hmm. Oh, it's one, two, three, four, f oh! Okay. Okay, here we go. We're getting through the complexity now. So we got one, two. And then we need three. I 
something like this, I think. This might do it. One, two, three, four, five. Yes, that does it. Ha, ah, I, I smooshed it in. <laughs> I probably could have made that one a little bit prettier, but it's okay, I did it. And I'm not done yet. I'm not done yet, there's one over here. Oh, look, that's so close. One, two, three, and then fit these in somehow. Hmm. It's hard with the, the, the pair. I need to curve it the other way. Oh, I wonder if... What kind of shape do I want here? I think I need to think about the shape first. I need it to be like... If I make it like a, a really... I think like having a curve here seems good. It's just figuring out how to get the get to the one and the three from here. Would it be like this? <gasps> it's like this. It's like this. Other way. It's like this. I'm, I miss them, but it is this. <gasps> oh, what a cool shape. Oh, it's really nice as well, because it's not just like the circles and the loops. There's other shapes involved as well. And they still manage to be just as satisfying to watch going around the loops. This is so well made. I love this. Okay, area two complete. I really love this. This is... This, this is like making my soul happy. <laughs> Oh, this is a single line now. I could have just reversed the direction. It would have been way more simple than what I did. So now we've got like, it goes to a portal and goes back to the beginning. It's not a continuous loop anymore. And it still doesn't manage to feel like stopping and starting. It still manages to flow so amazingly. That is so nice. Like, look how beautifully this still flows. Even though it's like stopping and starting, it's still continuous. Ooh, how do I get that? Like a little, it's like a little tick. Or like a little hook, like a crowbar or something. Like that. Or like the, <laughs> or like the Nike logo. <laughs> it's the Nike logo, yeah. <laughs> when I saw it with the full lines, I I was like, oh, actually, haha. <laughs> oh, look at this. How do I get these? How do I get these? Oh, wait, no, I think this is actually quite easy. If I, I start by going like over the top oh no I start down here I'm making like a like this kind of shape like a ribbon type shape like that yeah that does it look at that oh it's so pretty I gotta say as well I love the color design as well. The pastel colors with the dark background. It's so pretty. Okay, one, two. The, but the, why are these over here? Can I do like an S shape? I think I do like an S shape here, like this. Sorry, I moved it because I want it to look nicer. <laughs> yeah, look at that. All the way across. It's so pretty. It's so pretty. Oh, we've only got one handle here. And we have to start at one. And end at five. Oh, this is interesting. How do I do this?
How do I make a curve that big with just one handle? Hmm. Unless I'm like actually starting from like here. Okay, what if I try and work backwards? Right, does it have to be at the start of the line? Can I pick up... Can I do it like this? Like, it'll still go one, two, three, four, five, but after it's gone through the portal. Yeah, that works. <gasps> okay. <laughs> See, I instantly thought there with the portals, like, that would be the number one. But the line just keeps going. So long as it goes one, two, three, four, five, doesn't matter which point in the sequence it is. That's a, that's a good tutorial. <laughs> that's a really nice way of tutorializing that you you don't have to do it in that way. How do I do this one? Like a, like a spiral? Hmm. Hmm. I can get a loop to be like down here enough without going into the red that would work very nicely but can I do that <laughs> right it's really hard to get along that bottom loop so I think I've got to go through the middle I think I've got to make like an S like this Yeah, like this. There we go. And that'll be one, two, three. Yeah, look at that! Oh, it's such a nice shape. Yeah, it's so satisfying how you keep ending up with the simple symmetrical shapes as solutions. It really is. It's so lovely how it looks so dotted about and random when you go into a level and then you realize the solution, it makes like the most beautiful shape. Right, so one, two... Three, four, five. Ooh. Hmm. I like a curve along the three, four, and the five. Oh, because the three needs to be next. Oh, we can do that. <gasps> We could do this! Oh, 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 I see this one. I see this one. I see this one. No, not quite. Other way? So we go one, two, three, four, five. Yes! <gasps> yes! Look at that! Ha ha! It's getting the right order that's gonna be the tricky part. Like, it's very easy to make it go through all of the, the dots. But getting them to go through in the right order is the challenge. That's when you start adding the loops and stuff. With that, I have completed act area three. Oh, look at this. Look at this. This is so nice. Hold on. I'm, I'm just going to... I'm, I'm going to tab out of the game again for a second. I want to double check. Uh, in approximately less than an hour, the the Steam page has changed now. So we've got a we've got a closer time. It's less than an hour. So I I think maybe it'll release like on the hour, possibly. I want to keep checking because when that comes out, I want to start spamming the store link so people can buy it because this game is beautiful. This is lovely. This is really nice. 
But yes, now it is time for exclusive content. <laughs> Because uh, I think the, the game was being offered up before release date, but only for the for like content in the first three areas. So now uh, I've been given permission to play it at any time on the 22nd, which is today. A little part of me still feels awkward for like playing more before it's been released. So I may linger for a little bit. Look, who wants to chat for 20 minutes? <laughs> I could go back and see if I can make the levels prettier, because some of the shapes, I, I made them a, a little bit wobbly. See if I can make them all way neater. What if I bring these to the furthest corners? It's going to be the most symmetrical shape. It doesn't go through that like that. Okay. Now it's symmetrical. It is squashed symmetrical, but it's symmetrical. Haha. <laughs> we have an egg. Right, what else was there? This one. Oh, I wonder if I can try and recreate my thumbnail. Hold on. <laughs> I already solved this one, but what if? What if I try and make it like exactly this odd? <laughs> I'm gonna try and make it with the, the handles in the same places. I just realized I kind of just had the solution to this puzzle ahead of time. And I didn't even realize it until after I finished it. But yeah, it'd be like, like this. I want it to be neater. I want it to be neater than this. There, that looks like it. No, it's going through the, the red there, like this. Does that do it? There! There, that does it! I did it! Look at that! Look! Oh, I made it! I did it! I did it! My... <laughs> I made the thumbnail! Nice. But I'm I'm really loving this so far. I'm... I, I don't even think I... I have to wait because I was actively told I could just play it any time on the 22nd. But I, I, I just, I want to make wait because I, I want, I want people to buy this game because it's really nice. <laughs> oh, it's always such a nice surprise to me. Like as a streamer, when I'm offered a game, because sometimes when a new game is coming out, sometimes I will be cheeky and I'll like request a key in exchange for stream coverage and like guaranteed coverage. But it's very rare that they get offered to me like actively to me without me seeking it out and also for it being games that I would actually play like I've, I've received quite a few steam keys to my email address but sometimes I I look at the email and I'm like um thank you for sending this to me have you seen my channel <laughs> it'll be like a, a fast-paced platformer or something and I'll be like thank you very much but I'm I'm very much not the kind of person you're looking for with this game I apologize <laughs> but uh, occasionally I do get offers for games which are genuinely really good like the last time it happened I think it was uh delete after reading when I when I played delete after reading that game was so good I had never heard of it before I knew nothing about the devs I got offered a free key to play it and I saw it and it was like, oh, puzzle-based visual novel story game. And that that just ticks all of the boxes for me. It was like, you, you found the right person to play this. And that game was really, really fun. That was a really good game. I wish more people would play it because I, I would love to watch other people play it as well. But yeah, that was a really great game. And this one is also a really great game. I'm I'm loving it so much so far. Right, I wonder if I can make some of these a bit neater, actually. I don't know if I can make the egg neater. No, that's the, that's the neatest I can make this. Ah, <laughs> oh, you'll let Sumo know if they're making any puzzle games to send you a key. Oh my goodness, thank you. <laughs> thank you. 
<laughs> I really appreciate that though. I really, I, I just love puzzle games. I'm... It's like, there's quite a few people who refer to me as like the, the pink haired puzzle cat. And I'm, that's, that's, that's what I want to be known for. <laughs> I really love puzzles. I love puzzle games so much. It's what I enjoy the most. I want to just make like the prettiest shape I can for this. I'm trying to figure out what pretty shape I can make. I'm just making like a squashed egg every time. Can I make it prettier than this? No, all I can really make here is a squashed egg, I think. Oh, I can at least make it a little more symmetrical than this, surely. Oh, it's kind of, it's giving me pet rock vibes at the moment. No, I think that's the best I'm going to get for this one. Also, Flint, hello! Just noticed the stream, what did you miss? Don't worry, you haven't missed a super lot so far. You you missed me finding a video on machines uh, painting ceramic bowls. And also really satisfying puzzles. But uh, I'm I'm delaying the satisfying puzzles at the moment until the game officially releases. Oh yeah, and then this one looked like a rocket ship. Because it's got like the two little landing feet down here. Make this like a, a perfect right angle. I don't know if that's even. And then what if I just do that? Yeah, that works. Haha! -ha! Nice. But uh, welcome in! Happy Wednesday! I hope you're doing well. Welcome to Chill Puzzles. This is like, this is just so relaxing. You know what, I, I, I just want to keep playing them actually. I'm going to keep going. <laughs> Ooh, here we go. Okay, so we got one, two, three, four, five, six. So this is like a squashed shape. It's like we're making the circle and then we're squashing it in, in the middle. So we go like this and we bring it up and then down again. So it's like this kind of shape. Oh, it's like an eye mask. Oh, look at that. Oh, it was like an eye mask. Now it's more just a sausage. <laughs> oh, this is so great, though. Comfy vibes. Comfy puzzle vibes. Oh, one, two. This is another one I need to squash in like this, I think. But I, I need this here as well. Would that do it? Oh no, this is... Okay. Oh, I think that'll do it. Oh, look at that. Oh, it's like a boomerang. Oh, I love the way it, it flows around like that. Oh, this is great. I love how there's so many branches here. <laughs> it's like you, could, you only need two to unlock this, but I'm doing all of them. And let's start with the pink. Oh, I think this is going to be a... A loop kind of shape again. Maybe? Oh, I don't know. No, I think this is going to be another squash in one. Like, we have it like... This. Like that kind of shape. Yeah, this kind of shape. We bring this up a bit more to get the two in like this yeah we got it oh that one's more like the nike logo actually <laughs> oh this is this is re this is really nice to play this is such a nice game to play i'm so glad i think 
I might end up doing like a, a giveaway for this game or something. I'm I this is the kind of game that I would buy myself. <laughs> so getting it for free, I, I might do a giveaway and like so that I can buy it and support the dev. <laughs> Cause I'm pretty sure it's a solo dev as well who made this, and it's so nice to play. Also, Jack, hello, welcome, welcome. Reminds you of Infinite Loop. I feel like I recognize that name. I'm not sure where from. Is it like like a browser thing where you can make stuff or am I thinking of something different entirely? But welcome, welcome. Oh, uh, that one kind of reminds you of Oh, that one, yeah, the weird Pepsi logo when they when they when they changed it and had the the wooble with the top and the bottom. I I I see it. I see it as well. Do it, support indies. Yeah, well, I, I said I might do. I've already decided in my head that I will. <laughs> but yeah, this is this is a joy to play. This is so calming. And actually requires quite a lot of thought as well, which is surprising. Oh, this is going to have to be a spiral. We're going to have to have like a start around here and bring it around. Something like this. Okay, but that's the wrong that that's the wrong way round, but it's okay because we can just reverse it. One, two, three, four. Yes! And it's going around in a spiral. Nice. Nice! But yeah, I'm the this the fact that I got this as a free key is incredible, and I'm really, really glad. But I'm also going to buy the game. <laughs> See, I, I feel like I'm probably like an indie dev's favorite person to give a free Steam key to because I think every single game that I've gotten a free key to, I've either rebought it again afterwards for myself or gifted it to somebody else. So I I don't know why I request the free keys in the first place. I'm just going to buy the game anyway. <laughs> but this is a lovely game. This is such a lovely experience. I'm I'm so happy to be playing this. This is lovely. Right, this is going to be like this. One, two... Oh no, the three's there. Oh, I made a mistake. We make a little loop. We make a loop. We make a loop. Oh, look at that. Oh. It's getting to the part now where I'm having to make interesting shapes to match them all. But this is so nice. Oh, it's a mobile puzzle game where you swap curves around so they all link up. Oh, I love that! I love that. That's that's my kind of game as well. But yeah, this is this is really interesting because I thought it was going to be so straightforward. And it's it's actually requiring so much more thought than I thought it would. Right, so we've got one, two, three, four, five. Hmm. How do we get to the three in the corner here? It's like getting to the... Oh, oh! I was... I As I was saying it out loud, I uh, literally realized what I have to do. I was like, it's so hard to reach the corner ones. How do we reach the corner ones? We start in the corner ones. That's how we're going to reach them. <laughs> but yes, it's Puzzle Wednesday! I've kind of made this a thing too. It's like Puzzle Sunday became Outer Wild Sundays, so I need another day for all the puzzle games I want to play. <laughs> oh, but thank you for the hydrate and posture check too. I'll have a big stretch. And a sip of my monster. Ah. 
Have a little sip, and now I know what I have to do here. I love how bringing the curves around, I was like, how do we even reach these ones in the corner? And as I was saying it, I realized what I had to do. That's the most satisfying feeling. I want to see if I can do it by putting these in the corner. Oh my goodness, I can. Oh, that's a way bigger shape than I needed it to be, but it looks so nice. I, I'm so glad. I'm so glad I made that a way bigger shape than it had to be. Whimsical Wednesday. I really like that. Hold on, what are the W words are there? Hold on, let me... Let me get my dictionary. Let's see if we can find any other words that would work well. Uh, what have we got? Uh, I don't think witchcraft is the right thing here. Um. Oh, wait, my dictionary is saying wind chime. The chimes in the game really do make me think of wind chimes, to be honest. Oh, okay. Okay, we're, we're having an actual dictionary. Oh. <laughs> okay, thank you, Rika. <laughs> thank you for the Uwuktionary narration. Let's uh, open it to a random... Random W page. Thank you, what do we got? <laughs> okay, I'm actually going to veto this word for the first time ever. I am i don't feel comfortable with that word, so... Let's find another page! Ah -ha -ha. Boom. Wait, this- oh, this kind of works! Oh my goodness. Thank you for the evolutionary narration, Redeem. The word we have is... Wrap. Wrap, a verb. One, to cover or enclose in paper or soft material. Two, to encircle or wind round. Or wind wound. He wrapped an arm around her waist. <laughs> or three, in computing, to cause a word or unit of text to be carried over to a new line automatically. Or four, informally used, uh, to finish filming or recording. It can be also used as a noun, meaning a loose outer garment or piece of material, or two, a paper or material used for wrapping. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you for the Uwuktionary narration. That was actually a really long entry. But yes. Oh, and thank you for the, the, the normal dictionary narration as well. We've got M, the opposite of W. It's definitely how it works. Right. Letter M. What do we got? Boom. Okay. <laughs> Thank you for the, the dictionary narration, Redeem. We have the word mendacious. Mendacious. M-E-N-D-A-C-I-O-U-S. Mendacious is an adjective which means untruthful. And funnily enough, I know that word through Final Fantasy XIV. Because for a while, when I was playing Final Fantasy XIV, it's got to have been a while ago now, but they always give different names to the the tombstones you get every patch. And one of the patches, it was Tombstones of Mendacity. And I had no idea what Mendacity meant, so I looked it up and saw the meaning of uh, untruthful. Or un untruthfulness. So I already knew that one. But yeah, men Mendacious is a great word. It's such a cool word. Like, you know, being being so mendacious. Like, if, if someone is telling you loads of lies, you can say, can you believe the mendacity of this person? <laughs> I mean, you, you could technically say that, but uh, I don't think wow. a lot of people would know what I mean. <laughs> But yeah, I don't know how long ago the, the Tombstones of Mendacity were. Hold on. I'm going to look it up on my phone because I don't want to tab out of the game. I want to keep the ambient background sounds. When were the Tombstones of Mendacity? Not time zone. Mendacity. Uh, the, the Tombstones of Mendacity were retired in patch 5.0. 
Which patch was that? I don't know anything. I'm just getting stuff about the, the Moogle bringing back things, which was more recent. When were they? Where, I just want to find the patch they were in. <laughs> da, 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 da. Tombstone of Mendacity. Okay, patch 4.2. What was 4.2? Was that Stormblood? I think it was Stormblood. <laughs> Back when Stormblood was current content in Final Fantasy XIV. I think it is. Oh no, it, it, no, yeah, yes, it was Stormblood. It was Stormblood, okay. <laughs> Okay, I've sated my curiosity now. <laughs> Allegan Tombstones of Mendacity were released as part of Stormblood in Final Fantasy XIV, when that was still current content. There have been another two expansion packs since then. <laughs> so a little while ago. Oh, I still need to play more Endwalker. Gotta catch up before the new... the new expansion comes out. Okay, so we've got one, two, three, four, five, six. Oh! This is interesting. How do I do this? Like a little loop like that? Oh, I've made like a knot now. I think something like this is, oh yes. It's like that. One, two, three, four, five, six. Oh, look at that shape. I love that. It's got the little loop in the middle. It kind of reminds me of a, a light bulb, like a light bulb filament. That's so cool. Next one. I want to do all of these. One, two, three, four, five. This is going to be another spirally type one. I wonder if this one could be solved by just putting them in the corners in different orders. I bet it can. We start here. I think like... Okay, not quite the corners, but it's like this, I think. Oh no, these are the wrong way around. Swap them. No, I think it is the corners, like that. Look at that, I made a little star. I made a little star, look at that. Okay, it's, it's going the wrong way, but... Look, one, two, three, four, five. Oh, oh, I love that. I love that. It reminds me of, um, you know those spirograph things? When I was younger, I used to have this like spirograph thing. It's basically just a bunch of, like a round thing with a bunch of like teeth around the edge and you'd put it in another round thing and you'd put a pen in and as you're like drawing circles it would make like spirally patterns with it i used to love that thing i had so much fun with that thing it'd be like it would like move the pen around as you're drawing the circle because it would it would be like slightly off center and then you pick it up off the page afterwards and you've made like a really pretty spiral pattern i had so much fun with that they were so pretty. Oh, and we got the, ooh. We've got the, the red here. One, two, three, four, five, six. Oh, I think it's gonna be like, woo, 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 woo. Like that kind of spiral. I... Is that like the one? I need it to come like under, up, and around. Kind of like this. No, I think I'm doing this wrong. I I can imagine the shape I want in my mind. It's just actually creating it. I 
it's kind of like this, but this is not quite it. No, that's the wrong way around. Hmm. Because in my mind, I can see it. It's like it goes woo. Woo. Like that. I just need to figure out how I can make that shape real. Starting in like the most awkward way. Let's spread these points out. Okay, like this. Okay, so we start here. I want it to go under here. Then around like this, and then this will be like in the middle. And then we'll be back around to here. No, this isn't it again. I'm... <laughs> hmm. So I need it to be like... Under here. <gasps> no, yes! And then like this. Oh, I haven't got the six in here, though. And it's going... Do it the other way. Yeah, I'd, it'd be like this. But I need it to get the six as well. Oh, unless I do here and have this as... No, because it's not, it's, it's not picking up the... picking up the three when I do it this way. Hmm. There's the fact there's this red blob as well. Hold on, I'm gonna reset. Cause I need to reset the red blob. I do that and that. This is just very wrong. <laughs> oh, maybe like, oh, 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 almost, almost again. I'm missing the six again. I can't seem to get the six in as well. Oh no, move the... This one and here? Like that? <gasps> no, it's for it's here. I I'm missing the six every time. And it would be going the wrong way for me to do it like this, I think. Oh, maybe like this. Oh, oh. <gasps> Almost. This is it. Yes, I've got it. I've got it. I've got it. It's this shape. It's this kind of shape. I've got it. There it is. I think this will work. I think this will work. One, two, three, four, five, six. Yes. I got it. Nice. Oh, thank you for the hydrate too. And oh, I hope your lectures go well. I hope you have a I hope you have a, a productive day. I hope you learn lots. But thank you for stopping in. I hope you have a, a lovely Wednesday. I will have a sip as you leave. Thank you for the confetti as well. Oh, I, I love how in my mind I was like, I can imagine the shape here and it was not that shape. That was not the shape I needed to make. Oh, this is great though. One, two, three. Oh, oh that's, that's an easy one. Hold on. Yeah, this one's just going to be like this, right? Yeah, like that. One, two, three, four, five, six. Ha ha. Now we've got double loops. Oh, yes. <laughs> 
And that's looping again. Oh yeah, that one's like the game logo. It is. Haha. <laughs> nice. It looks like a sweet. Like, you know the sweets where they're like twisted at the ends? It reminds me of those. And I like that this also twists to go to the next levels as well. <laughs> like, oh my goodness, hi. We got a lot of red blobs of doom over here. Oh, oh, yeah, I think doing like. Not that one. Which one do we need here? Hold on. I think having a loop like this over here. Oh no, I missed the two. It's okay, I can still reach it like this. are going through here and that's gone to the three but I I need the two before the three hmm it's getting all of these little dots that really adds like an extra level of challenge to this because it doesn't matter what order you get the little dots in, so long as you do get them. Yeah, this is the wrong order. Hold on, I'm resetting, I made a mess. Right, because it's just one, two, three, four. It It seems like it should be easy to make a loop here. But it's not. <laughs> going like this oh it could just be like this oh that yeah look at that look at this <gasps> haha oh it's like it's like a little umbrella shape <gasps> yeah I like this one look at that sorry I'm making it more even there we go we got them all one two three four it is it's like an umbrella or like a little manta ray or something <laughs> Oh, like a manta ray! I love. Oh, I love that you you typed that exactly as I said it. Oh my goodness! <laughs> Great minds. Great minds. Okay, one, two, three, four, five, six. Hmm. One, two, three. Four, five, six. Maybe something like this. No, I haven't quite managed to reach the six into here. Oh, I could if I do it like this. Then I need... I need to get the five in as well, though. Be like this okay we've got like five six one if i can now make this go to like two and three oh ooh, ooh, ooh. made a really interesting shape here but i think this should work yeah look at that okay wait for it to go around again we go one two Six. Yeah! Oh, that one's really nice. I definitely could have made it more symmetrical, but it worked, so hee <laughs> hee. Oh, the game froze, no! Oh no, I clicked out of the game. It didn't freeze. Thank goodness, I, I had a moment of fear there. 
no, it was just me being silly. We're, we're fine. We've completed area four. And also, hold on, let me check something real quick. Uh, the release date is still less than an hour. I want, I'm going to keep checking the Steam page for when it gets released. Because I would, I would like to post that as soon as it comes out. But I, I think we're just waiting now. It might be half past. It might release at half past. I'll check then. But oh, this is such a joy to play so far. What, what is this one? I've got a theory. I think that one might end up being you've got to go through it twice. go through it twice one. Nice. Got it. Ha ha. Infinity symbol. Uh, the game isn't out yet. I, I will be posting it in chat when it is. <laughs> but if you want to keep an eye out yourself as well, uh, I've pinned the link to the, the store page for this game. And it's, it is coming out soon. Very soon. <laughs> Oh, oh, this is interesting. <gasps> Wait, they're stuck in little boxes. <gasps> Ooh. This is clever. You've, you, they're, they're trapped in the boxes now. I can't just move them anywhere. But we did it. I made a little, um... Hershey kiss, I guess? What else is that a shape like? My first thought was like a potion bottle, but it's too, too round. We have an egg. There's two of these. Okay, so. So the solution here is clearly going to be. Oh, I, I don't think I can have like two crossover points. Oh, I can just do it like this. There we go. I need to make these closer. There, and now it'll just go through both of them. Very, very narrow one. <laughs> Look how thin that one is. It's tiny. Oh, and now there's, there's so many now. I love how I only need to do one of each of these branches, but I'm going to be doing all of them. Oh. More go through them twice ones. They're not, they're, they're only gonna go through them once here, I think. So that is not the solution. Oh wait, it could just. Could just be as simple as, no, that's only going through once again. Oh no, just do it like that. Just do a, a like a bouncy curve. That'll work. This'll work. Okay, I want to try and make it. As neat as possible. There. There we go. We've got one, two, and we hit them both twice. It is just a line, but it's such a nice line. Look at how it bounces back and forth. Ooh. How are we gonna get this twice? got an idea for this one. It's all about whether I can actually pull it off or not. But I think if we can get like the, the crossover point to be right where that dot is. Whilst also like going around this. 
Also, having it not hit the red is the hardest part here. Yeah, I've just fully missed the one now. Hee <laughs> hee. I haven't got it twice. It's like we've got the one and the two, but this is only being hit once. How can we make it hit this again? Oh, just, I can just do the curve again. It's just the curve again. I'm silly. Also, look, it, we, we've got the pink and the teal next to each other here. I'm, I like this puzzle. I like the puzzle. We just got the Liri colors together. <laughs> Aha. Yeah, I think this is the tutorial that's like, hey, you know how you've been making shapes? Don't be afraid to make the lines overlap. Sometimes you gotta. Hmm. That one only needs to be gotten once. This one needs to be gotten twice. So I think what we do is we do a little... Like this. Look at that. We got it twice. We got a fish. Or a chicken drumstick. <laughs> and this one. Oh, there's like a there's like a gateway here. Oh, these all need to be gotten twice. don't know what I'm doing at the moment. I'm, I'm making loops and hoping they will work. If I can get it. Yes, like a loop like that. There, we got them both twice. And it keeps going around. Nice, we're down to here. Oh uh, yeah, the challenge here is getting them twice. So I'm thinking we have loops. Oh, I always forget, like... Even though they're so nicely color-coordinated, I always forget, like, which one is, like, next to the next one. So I'll move something and it'll affect others that I don't expect, even though... It would make sense for the teal one to affect the blue one because they're so close in the color wheel. Right, how do I do this? Because I'm, I'm thinking I just go like... Like that. Like add a little loop here. It's just figuring out the optimal way to do that. a little loop and we go around and then we go like there's a little loop and we go around yeah I think this will do it yes it's not it's not the neatest I want to make it pretty I want to make it pretty okay <laughs> I found the solution but I want to make it pretty now so uh hold on Nah, that'll do, that'll do, there we go. So then we go one, boop, boop, two, boop, boop. Just add the little, little bits on the end. Oh. Three different threads here, let's go for this one. Oh. I'm just going to start by putting things down. I 
drop things down and see what happens. Yes. I need to get down to the two here as well. Here we go. Okay, we, we do the, the line overlap. Yeah, I think just the, the line overlap. Just like that. We've got a little wiggle. Helps if I don't miss it. Uh, like that. Because then we go one, do, 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 two, do, do, do. And we got them both, got them both twice. Both, three of them. Got all three of them two times. I don't know numbers. I'm silly. All right. Oh, these these are just one. This one's two. Oh. I love the sounds it makes when you move them, though. works. Two, and then I'll be... Hmm. I can't quite reach down here. It's like too far down. Unless I do that. Like, I've, I've, if I do this, it works. Oh, it's the wrong way around for these. Oh, I see what I've got to do now. And then I bring this down. Now I keep this up a bit, and then I need to have that intersecting that. There we go. Oh, look at that shape. Oh, that's so nice. That's so nice. It's like an hourglass. Oh, I got it. Oh, that's a really nice shape. <laughs> okay. Whoa. Well, this one is so interesting because it immediately sets, like, what seems like a clear path. Going, like, through. Like, four, five. One, two. I can't reach three down here, though. I can if I... Hmm. Yeah, I'm only getting them all one time this time, so this, this is definitely not it. How can I get these twice? Like, I've got the crossover here. I feel like I need the crossover with all of these. Look at this. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three. So the fact that the three and the four are so far apart, I think having the start and the end at three and four makes sense. So so then it would be like four, five, one, two, three. I need it to like loop like this. Like, this kind of shape, I think, would be right. Yes, and it's going through them twice. Yes, it is this. Oh, I feel smart. It's like a pretzel. Oh, it's going the wrong way. Hold on. Yeah, that's definitely it. I've got it. One, two, three, four, five. I made a little pretzel, or a bow, or a knot. <laughs> Surprise spoiler attack! Oh, hello. A friend. 
<laughs> welcome in. Welcome, welcome. Welcome to Puzzle Time with pretty shapes and calming music and a lots of spirals and patterns. But you gotta go through that three times. Oh my goodness, okay. No, this is even less now. I made it worse. Hmm. How can I get this three times? That kind of gets it three times. If I can make this meet all of the other points as well. Oh, I think, yeah, I think this will work. If I can make this meet the other points. Didn't quite reach it there. There. See if this works. No, it's only two. I need to move this up to there. There, that should do it. One, two, three. Ha ha. I got him! Blum, blum, blum. Also, can I just say as well, that's that's such a cute spider. That is a really cute spider. <gasps> the game's out now! Oh, 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 oh. Yes, it was half past, wasn't it? <gasps> yes! The game is out and it is so cheap. It is so cheap for such a great game. Check it out, check it out. Yay! Check out Oros in the Steam Store. This game is such a joy to play. This is such a lovely, lovely game to play. Please check it out. Please, please support the, the creators, creator. I think it's, I think it's just one person. <laughs> but it's, these are so well thought out as well. Like I'm having to, actively think about which order to do things in. I really like this. It's exactly the kind of puzzle I like. It's like the, the trial and error, figure things out, see what works, see what doesn't, until it does. That, it, that's like my favorite kind of puzzle. This one's four times. Oh my goodness, okay. Gotta pass through this middle part four times. At that point, I'm like, do I just do a, a load of a load of curves in the middle? I think I save all of these for the middle. I right, we got two now. just use two points to get that. I don't think I can. I don't know how many times it's going through these, but I, I still haven't reached the two. Oh, maybe, maybe? Maybe? Is that four? I'm missing the one. Uh -huh. Like this, maybe. This might do it. No, I missed it for that one. It's so hard to hit it four times. Just missed the three there. I've got it three times. I need it one more time. Mm. How 
can I get? Again, would that do it? No, because it's like on the same line. I need it again. I'm still only three. Another twist in somewhere. It's like one, two, three. Yeah, how do I get a fourth? Yeah, then that'll only be two, won't it? Yeah. another twist. We've got a twist here. Oh, if I do this on the other side as well, make like a like a flower shape in the middle. Okay, how do I do that? Got green, cyan, blue. So it'd be like purple, pink, orange. Like this? Almost, almost. And then I bring that in. Oh. Will that do it? No, that hits that twice though. Is that gonna be a problem if it hits it twice? Oh, it's in the wrong order. It's in the wrong order. Hold on a second. Let me very quickly just. Oh, why is it not going from the overlay when I do that? Whenever there's like a bot ban, it's... <laughs> Sorry, bot gets it too quickly and it doesn't vanish from my overlay. That's oh, alright, I'll just refresh it. Nothing to see there. Sorry about that. Don't worry, the chat should still work. Yeah, I think it's not working now because it's in the wrong order. It's, how do I make it like the one? Oh no, just do it this way. Will this do it? So I go like one, two, three. <gasps> yes, it does work. It does work. I was worried this one might not work because I was going over it a couple of times, but I don't think it matters. It's only when there's like the outlines. I think I managed to skirt around the edge of it. Right. Oh, this is a back and forth one. How do I do it three times? Oh, like this. Back and forth and back. Like that, we go bounce, we go bounce, we go bounce. We just go back and forth. We do a little scribble in the middle to hit them all. <laughs> nice. Oh, I bet I could make that one look prettier, actually. I think if I did this one, I could do like a kind of like zigzag through them, which would look a bit cooler. Yeah, I made like a like a little zigzag, a, the tiniest zigzag. <laughs> I did it! Area 5 complete! Look how the line goes. I love how it all spirals out here as well. Alright, we're in Area 6. We got two portals this time. Well, that is easy enough. We do 1, 2, 3. And then we do 4, 5, 6. Yes. One, two, three, four, five, six. Yeah, look at that. I did not make those very symmetrical, but it's okay. I 
Let's go this one. Ooh, one, two, three, four, five. Okay, no, I think the four five is going to be like this. So we need to figure out one, two, three. Oh no, I'll bring this down to the one. The curve will be like this. Got one. And then I can use this to get all of these like that. Yeah, look at this. This should work. So now we go one, two, three, four, five, six. Yeah, I got them all. I wrote the letter A. <laughs> How about this one? One, two, three, four. Yes. Oh no, actually getting the... Oh, actually, I think I go one... Two, three... Four, one. And then I do the, the, the curve like this. Yes, yes, I think I got this one. So that I can get both of the two points, I need to get them with both lines. So we go one, two, three... Four, one two, three, because then we can get both of these points with both of the lines, like that, one, two, three, four, and we hit them both twice, yeah! And this one, ooh, okay, this one's just a one, this one is twice. One, two, three, four, five. Hmm. But I want... Oh, four, five, one. Two, three. I think it's going to be a curve down here and then a curve up here. So we go curve up here. down here. I'm, I'm trying to make them like as symmetrical as possible because I want it to look really pretty. Yeah, I think this is it. Oh no, wrong way. Oh no, it's, it is going the wrong way. I just put, I just put the two, three line the wrong way around. Uh, <laughs> that's fine. Look at this, it's so pretty. Okay, so we go one, two, three, four, five. Cross over in the middle. We made like a, like a bridge, like an archway. That one's a pretty one. I, I feel like when I notice a solution and I realize I can make it like a symmetrical shape, I just kind of want to make it like the most perfect, pretty symmetrical shape I can. <laughs> like even though you can solve it without it having to be perfectly even my my little like satisfied brain is like let's make it even Ooh. we've got to hit these with both of the lines but these we only have to hit with one this and see what happens. So then it'd be like four, one. Two, three. But I need to hit both of these with both of them. So th this is tricky.
Four one could work like this. Oh, it's not quite going through though. Hmm. I don't think that's actually hitting the four like this. Cause like this goes one, two, three. Oh no, it is hitting the four, but oh, I missed one. And I'm missing this one here. I don't know how I can get that with both of these though. Hmm. Oh, oh, I think I've realized what I have to do. Let's move them, move these out of the way. Move these over here. I think actually I do, I go like one, two, and then I go three, four. So one, two, three, four. Yes, that's gonna be how I do it. So there's the one, two. And then three, four. Yes. Yeah, like that. Ah, oh, it's interesting figuring out which order to try. It's so pretty. Oh, more curves. More curves. Oh, but I need to get both with... Oh, I think I know what I do here. I think it's just one, two, but I make it curve into them all. And then three, four, and we make it curve into them all. Like that. So we go one, two, three, four. And we hit them all. Oh no. I need to. I can't do what I wanted to. I, I can't hit the two again. But it is like this in the middle. We come back just to get the, <laughs> these shapes. There we go. So now we go one, one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Ha ha. We made it. Oh, love how the game uses the shape of the line as a clue. Yeah, right. It's, it's such a really really nice way of doing it as well like you kind of realize the shape it's making and it gives you that moment of oh yes i think i'm doing the right thing the solutions always look so nice <laughs> gotta hit that four times actually no this is really easy this is easy i've already figured this one out it's just back and forth one one two And three, four, in the other way. Like this. He <laughs> one, two. Ha <laughs> ha! It looks like a straight line, but there's so much going on in this line. Oh, I also I, I I I always feel really smart when I when I look at a puzzle and I'm immediately like I know what I have to do here. Oh, all of these I've got to hit all of them with each line. Do a loop. Like that. Yeah, I think I do a loop like that, and then the same over here. Loop like that. And I'd like this way. Line it up nicely. Look, look how cool that looks. Look at the shape of this. Look, this is really cool. Watch this. One, two, ha. <laughs> Oh, that's so pretty. It's so nice. Let's move along to area seven.
This is such a charming little game. I love this. What does well, what does this do? Hold on. Science time. I I wonder if it means when I hit that one I have to hit this one next. Yes, I think it does. Yes. Thankfully, we know how to do that. I'm making it symmetrical. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I must. There we go. That's good. One. Two. Ha ha. So now they don't have numbers, so they don't have a specific order. But they do have their own individual order that you can... Oh, look how nice that looks. It's, it's got like a little bow. <laughs> so you can do them at any point in the loop. Oh, now it's got to be that one to that one. So it's going to be like a squashed shape like that. Like this. Like an eight. Yeah, look at that. Eight. Eight. It looks so nice. I love it. I love it. But that's really interesting because it's... You don't have to do it in the order of one, two, three, four. You can slot it in between any of the numbers. But you have to hit them both at the same time. Oh, so I've got to hit that before I hit one. And then after I hit two, I have to hit that one. <gasps> Very cool. And also I know exactly what to do. Sorry, I must make it pretty. There we go. We must follow the arrows. Very important. Also, Lyra, hello. Welcome, welcome. Good morning. Look how pretty these puzzles are. This game is so pretty. Oh my goodness. Okay, so we go ba ba bum. Ba ba bum. Oh, that's just a little squash shape. shape it's going the wrong way at the moment but it won't be there so we go one two we got the boomerang man i i forgot how to make that kind of shape work for a second then <laughs> just moving all of the little handles like how did i make that before ah <sighs> oh. okay we got lots of lines here so the three, four, five has to go around this way. But we gotta hit that twice. Hmm. Oh, actually, I think if we start. Hmm. Oh, it's like I think. I want I want this to like end here. So that's the end. So we actually start at like the two. And come all the way around to the three, four, five. Like this. I think I can make this work. Just gotta get the the angles of the curves in the right positions. Oh, I'm I'm just missing the one entirely now though. How did I How do I hmm 
It's like, I need to bring this down for another curve, like this. Oh, oh no, it's working, it's, yes. I can make this work. You go around like this. Look how pretty that shape is. We got it. One, two, three, four, five. We got it. We got the Google Play logo. <laughs> right, this one. Right, because this it starts at one and goes in and then it has to go to two. I think it's gotta be like this and then we just... Yeah, like that, look. Oh, it's so neat. I got it. Oh, that's so nice. That also kind of had a bit of a hint with the arrows on that one, too. Like, the, the way the arrows were pointing was, like, the same shape that it the curve had to be. So that helped a little bit along that line. That was nice. Right, how about this? Ooh! Okay, one, two, three, and then it's gotta hit that. Okay. two up here in a neat way right let's let's start up here because of this horrible red and then we do like curve around to this three which is then then has to go to that dot. Oh, is that too close? Two, three. It does hit it, but I'm also just not hitting anything else. Oh, but it's, yeah, after I hit the three, I've got, I have to immediately hit this one. Oh, so actually, before we hit the three, we bring the two up to here. And then we come around to the three. Like that, that does work like this, but I'm still not bringing the rest of it in. Like, I've got the one and the four missed out of this loop. So that's a way that we could do the two, three, four, but it's not... ideal? What if I start with the three? I'm gonna start at the three. Because I think this could be brought around to the four very easily, and then we can go like one, two, like this. It's just making sure the four hits this, and then we still get this dot as well. We start at this dot. We make a little snake. We're making a little snake. This should do it, I think. One, two, three, four. Yes. We do a little wiggle. Got it. Hee <laughs> hee. This one. Oh, okay. So we got to go one, two, one, two, three, four. Oh, we just have to make a really nice spirograph 
drawing again. Easy. It's spirograph time. I've forgotten how I made the shapes before. I forget how curves work. <laughs> I'm really bad with curves. One, two. So I need to make like a little like round and round. So at that point, I'm wondering, do I do I do like these? <gasps> yes. And then and it needs to come down to the three. would be much better if I was I knew how curves work. <laughs> oh, it reminds me of like whenever I'm using Photoshop or Clip Studio Paint and I'm trying to use the curves tool and I think I know the angle a curve is going to go in and then it proceeds to very much not go in that order. I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to start by like doing this. because it's just like a, a line but overlapping doesn't feel like I'd have to do it too weirdly yet here I am one actually we'll go like, we'll go like one two I've made such a weird shape right now. I can see what I have to do. I just can't make the curve actually go that way. Hmm. I'm gonna reset. Right, this is like so far out. It's like these two are closer together. So I wonder if are they closer together? No, I don't I don't think actually. Maybe. I'm thinking I'd bring it like four or five. Round to a one to come around to the two. This needs to come around to the three. This needs to come around to the four. I'm getting a little closer. This is this is turning the wrong way here. 
This needs to go further. Oh, I think I'm I'm getting it. I'm getting it. I'm getting it. I'm getting it. Oh yes, there we go. That's the shape. That's the shape. Finally, I'm fine. I found it. I found it. I found the shape I need. I did it. There we go. My little atom is finally made. Oh, I'm so bad at judging like where the points need to be. <laughs> I don't know what it is. I can't like imagine the shape in my mind for some reason. Right, well, we've got some nice red blobs of doom here. The atom, yeah, it's so cool. It's really cool realizing how you can make so many shapes just with a single line. It's just figuring out where to put, where to put everything and where to put all the points and what angles they're going at. Right, so this one is one, two, Three, four. I, th I think I know what this is going to look like. The question is whether I can pull it off or not. Right, so we've got to go directly from one, one to two. The one to two has to happen. Do I go like all the way around the edge? No, because the next thing I need is a three here. I think it's going to be something like... Because that one I need to get after I've gotten four. This is a really cool looking shape, but I've missed so many points with it, so I don't think it's this, but... Oh, oh it could be. Hmm. Oh no, I can't because of the blob here. I was gonna try and make it really nice and symmetrical, but I cannot. Can I just bring it up the top like that? That might work. Hmm. One, two. Okay, the one and the two that way, and then I think I bring it around like this. No, I can't hit that one yet. I do need the three. And then I need the four to then hit this one. How do I do this? Oh my goodness. Yeah, it needs to go four to this one. this point. I've got all of it except this point by doing this. So how do I fix this? With this? Oh, 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 oh. I see the shape now. Oh my goodness. Yes. I've got it. I've got it. Look at that shape. Look at the shape this is making. That is such a cool shape. Look at that. Look at this. Yes. Oh, one, two, three, four, five. I love that shape. I love that shape. That's so cool. It's so cool, the helix shape. I wonder if there's going to be a level where it just turns into like a strand of DNA. <laughs> it wouldn't surprise me. Okay, so we gotta go this way. That's the shape I need. I just need to actually make that shape. I know the shape I need. I just need to make it. It's like this kind of shape. Now turn it, twist it like that. No, it's twisted too much now. Like this, ha ha. No, and then I bring this up for the three. Yes, yes, look at that. 
One, two, three. Oh, I missed the three, but yes, this is the shape. Yeah, one, two, three, four. Yes. Ha ha. And we're on to the next area. Completed area seven. We are on to eight. Oh, look how gorgeous it is. Look, look at this. All the little strands. Oh, okay. These are trapped in the box. But I need this to hit one. And then go back and hit that again as well. Because the problem is it has to go one and, like, back and forth. Would it just be like that? Would that work? Yeah, that does work. Okay. Nice. I feel like we're going to have more trapped in boxes now. Oh, no. No, we've just got more, like, the double paths. Hmm. That should do it. Like that. Got him. Okay, let's try this one. So it's like, I have to make it go from the one to there and then from here to the one as well. Oh, this one's a straight line. Okay, well, like, I'm just like, we start here and we end here, right? Uh, <laughs> two, three, maybe not. That three is really high to the top, which makes me think I, I do a starting point here. I do a nice little spirally path around to here. Hmm. Ah, now I do this. So I have to get that one twice. tricky one because it feels like there aren't enough points to make this work but there have to be because I have to start with like one to two and then to three to four that I need to hit both of these twice as well is interesting. Hmm.
can't reach that three up there if I do it this way. I'm just making circles now. Right, how do I want this to look? Let me move all this to the corner for a second. How, what kind of line do I want to make here? Because I know I need to go like this. Could it be like a loop like that? No, because I need to get back to here too. So it'd be like one. Oh, maybe like. Hmm. Yeah, like four, one. Oh, it might be like this way. So we start like the four and then go this way and then it goes back and around. It, I think that might work. at the moment yeah but it's not going through that where it needs to after I hit the one I need to hit this one so it's oh I, I could still do that if I do like this <gasps> oh yes I think I've got it I think I've got it I got it yes haha <laughs> so we go one two three four yes there it is there it is, just a bit of planning. Wow, that was tricky. I'm I I fully missed like the direction to do that in. Okay, this is just like we we're just spiraling in and out from the middle, aren't we? I think. Like something like this. I've I've made it very messily at the moment, but something like this kind of shape. Does it have like the back and forth between them all? I've I've not done this very well. <laughs> oh, it's because of the pink here. It's really hard to get down to that. No, this won't work because it needs to go back to the middle before everything. But I feel like I've gotten the, the twists the wrong way around. Oh, this way! Is this how the twists go? Yeah, this is it. This is it. This is it. Hee <laughs> hee. Now I got him the right way. I just need to make him overlap in the middle. Perfect. There we go. This should work, I think. So we go one, two, three. And we got all three of them. Oh, I really like that shape as well. Reminds me of a fairy. A little fairy shape. Right, what's this one? Ooh. I know what to do here immediately. like this and this and then I bring it down in the middle oh I can't make it go up enough gotta make this smaller I can't reach I can't reach them it, it feels like the right shape but I cannot reach Oh, what if I, I, I don't, I don't even have to, wait, I'm silly. I don't have to make it like a loop. I could literally just curve it like this, I think. No, they're not like close enough. I need to, because I need to hit them twice. Hmm. I thought I almost had it, but I'm... I'm 
missing the one if I do this. Which is why I thought having the little loop would work, because then the curve would be able to be a bit... a bit bigger, but I, because of the handles, I can't reach that far, so... Maybe it's not right. We'll see. Squeeze them a bit more. Make it tiny. I can't quite reach. I'm just slightly too short. Short? Why did I say short? I don't know. I can just go like... Oh! 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 This shape. This shape? I think maybe? No, this still like, it goes down too far. I don't know how to pick up the one in this. Like just going like the back and forth between the two and the three, that's really easy. So I can just do that, but I'm missing out the one. Hmm. I don't know how to fit the one in here. Let's try it from a different... Different idea, different... Different wiggles. It's like, when I hit that, I have to hit three. When I hit three, I have to hit that. So it's gotta be like... If we make it like, oh, loop, loop. Make it a loop, but like the the point. Yes. Then the point of the loop is like over this one, so it hits it twice. Yes, I think this is it. Girls, oh ho ho. Like that. There we go. That that got it. That got it. I just gotta remember the loops. Whenever there's a two one, the loops are so helpful for that. Because they they go through it and then they go back again in the same direction. One. Great. Two, three, four. Hmm. First thing I'm thinking. I need more loops. I need so many loops. How many loops can I make here? Oh, something like this feels like it would work if I can then bring this. So down to here. Hmm. I'm missing the two out here. Right, maybe if I go like... No, I, I have to hit that with the one first, so... Hmm. I'm gonna move them all out of the way again and try and think it through, because that actually helped last time. <laughs> Right, one has to hit that. I think it's gotta be like this. Hmm. Ah, oh, but here, like the three. When it hits that, it has to hit the three. It's like, uh. Curve. Curve like that, maybe. The fact they all have to be hit twice is what's getting me at the moment. I've. <laughs> like, let's start with like down, down, up. Boom, boom, boom. Okay, I've got a shape. <laughs> Just this? Would this work? If I can. 
make everything else line up with it. Oh, I... The handles are too short. Oh, the handles are too long here. Can't bring it down. It does feel close. Can't reach anything. I can't reach. <laughs> oh, done. I'm gonna have some monster. I kind of imagine a shape in my mind, but I don't know if I can physically make the shape I'm imagining. Oh, maybe I can. Maybe I can make the shape I was imagining. Ooh. No, I'm I've like I've got this horrible shape in the middle here. And it's getting around this blob is hard as well. Like, because I have to go through twice. How do I hmm? There's my there's my little circle. You you just go around there for a little bit. You just you just have a nice little time going around over here while I try and think this through. So I can go one two. Right, I I feel like I imagine something in my head. I'm not sure if I can make it. You know what I'm gonna do, actually? It's been a little while. I say it's been a little while, it's not been a little while. It's been, like, a really short amount of time. It's been, like, a week. I'm, I'm bringing out the paint. I'm bringing out the Microsoft Paint. Give me a second. Because <laughs> I want to see if I can draw the shape I'm imagining in my head. Because if I can... It'll help me like visualize it better. Hold on, what am what am I doing? I've forgotten how to resize. Okay, I've got Microsoft Paint. Let me see if it will work. I'd like to show it on the screen. Um, well, it's it's showing a little bit. Hold on, where's when? <laughs> oh, there we go. Ba, 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 ba. All right, here's the window. We got Microsoft Paint. We've got the level. And Vicky, hello, welcome. How's it going? Welcome, welcome. You joined me at an interlude. I'm I'm trying to figure out how to do this level, but I think like if I can draw it the way I picture in my mind. I think it would help for actually visualizing how to make that. Because what I'm thinking is we have like spins around like this. Like, hold on, no, that's the wrong way. Uh, this no not quite all right hold on let's let's try it like this I had to be like that <laughs> like that kind of shape I think it would work if it's going like boop 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 like around like that. I feel like it would work. I just need to figure out how I can make that shape now. But I think I think that is it. Thank you, elevator music. Back to game. 
Right, let's see if I can actually recreate this. Because how many... I've got six points, so I feel like I should be able to make it. So we got, like, one point here. Point here. Point here. Point here. Point here. Point here. Right, it's a little messy start. But I feel like I should be able to make this shape. This feels like a doable shape to create. Yes, I think... Going like... Yeah, going like this... Hmm. Hold on, I'm going to move the paint window. Like there. <laughs> okay. It feels really close. This feels close to me. I just got to line it up properly. I think this is it, though. I think this is the solution. I just need to finesse it now. Yes, yes. <gasps> is that it? I think I got it. It's going the wrong way around, though. I think I've got it. Two, three. That missed? Don't miss it. Please, hit that one. Here we go. Okay, one, two, three, four. Yes, I got it. I got it, the paint, the Microsoft paint. It works every time. <laughs> Yay, it worked. Thank you, paint window. You can go now. Bye bye. I'm so glad. I'm so glad. I could imagine it in my head, but like when I was trying to make the shapes, I kept losing what I was imagining in my mind, so. Oh, I'm okay. <laughs> I knocked something off my desk and I was worried, but it was just my phone. I don't need that at the moment. But yeah, I feel like it's... Things like Microsoft Paint are so useful for, like, if you can imagine something, but you're trying to, like, remember the visualization as you're doing other things. <laughs> it helps me, like, get my ideas out to... Oops. To work through my brain a little bit. Oh, here we go. This is just a spiral like this. I know how this has to go. It's just a matter of figuring out how. Like this kind of spiral. It goes like this, this. I see this one. I don't need paint for this one. I know how I want this one to go. <laughs> okay, that needs to move down a little bit. Like this. Yeah, look at that. That's so beautiful. I love that. This one is this one really reminds me of the Spirograph art spinny thingies. And I used to love them. I used to have a little Spirograph thing of my own. And it'd be really nice because it's basically you get like they're almost like cogs that you put into like a machine. And then as it's rotating, there's a dot on the inside and it moves around as you draw a circle. So your pen just starts making spiral shapes. It's really, really cool. I had so much fun when I was younger with it. Okay, so that's a one, two, three, four. Okay, so. I can imagine this one in my head as well, okay. One, two. Like 
that look. I, I think I'm getting the hang of this now. I think I'm getting the hang of how the, the curves work a little bit better. I'm getting better at drawing the curves. I think this should do it. I think I, that will go through. It's like slightly... There, okay. Yes, it worked. I'm getting there, I'm slowly but surely. Oh my goodness, okay, so one. But that has to go back, forth, back. Okay, um. More curves. slightly off but yeah I think I think it's this back and forth back and forth hmm no I th it is not quite because it needs to go back, forth, back, forth. So I gotta make a little S. Make a little snake. And go back and forth like that. Will that do it? I think this might do it. So we go. Oh, I hit it one, one too many times at the end. So it is like that. Okay. One, two, three, four. Yes, I got it. A little boop. And now we can move on to here. Oh, okay, so we got one, two, three. Oh. This having the back and forth. I've got to hit that before I hit the three, because I need to hit that three that if I hit the three first I won't be able to hit that a second time so it's got to go one two this three this four five six yeah I think I think I think I can make sense of this one we'll start with one, two, and seven. Yeah, because I think the three is going to have to be like that. I've lost the loop for the three here if I do it like that though. Hold on, yeah. Like this, this isn't reaching the four, but I can move that. Okay, this should do it. One, two, three. Oh no, it doesn't, I lost the loop again. There we go. Three, three, four, five, six, yeah. Oh, that one's really like a fish. Look at that, the fish shape. Oh, I like that. That's a good shape. I, oh my goodness. Okay. So we have to hit this before we hit one. I think... We go one... Like this. And then also... Up 
here we do like the same thing. We have a loop up here as well. Like this. And then the three, four, five. Yeah, this was this was a nice one. This is a nice one. Yeah, that one's fairly straightforward. That's a nice one. Just gotta make sure we hit them all. So we go one. Oh no, I wrong order. This way. We go one, two, three, four. Ha <laughs> ha. Yeah, lots about figuring out the symmetry as well. I think once you figure out what you want it to look like, what you think the shape is, it makes it a little easier to like figure out the solution. This is so cool though. Also, Brinley, hello, how's it going? Welcome, welcome, how are you doing? Welcome on in, this game is so cool. This game, uh, it's only just been released. This game was released today. And this, it's so cool. It's got such a simple concept. It's just, you have a line, you have points that you can adjust on that line. And then you try and connect all of the points in the right order. And it sounds so straightforward, but it gets so tricky so easily. Like here, we've got to go one, two, three, four, five, six. So that's going to be like that kind of shape. But we have to hit this before we hit the one. So, oh, do I do it? Do I do these? that for the one one so I could go like one like this and then I have to hit all of these twice. I need to figure out how I can hit all of these twice though. But yeah, it is like playing with vectors. It's it it very much reminds me of like when I'm using the curve tool in art programs and I never know how to use them. <laughs> I can't judge the curves. I'm so bad. But thank you for the hydrate as well, Suzume. I will have some more monster replenish the brain cells right I think what I'm going to do is I'm, I'm gonna do another paint window it's time to get paint out again you can have a hello my little circle you just have a little my egg have a little egg in the corner have have a little spin around for a bit while I figure this out and now It's time to get paint out. Where is my window? My, I need to sort out my OBS. It is such a mess. I've lost my paint window. Where is my paint? Oh, here it is. Here it is. Here's my paint window. Right, let's draw on it. Let's try and figure out what this shape should look like. So I'm thinking it's going to be like... Because this has to be hit before the one, so I think it's going to be like one. I'm going to work backwards. I'm going to go six, five, four, three, two, like that. It's not going to be this though, because we need to hit these twice. Right. So, well, we know this is right. This is, like, going to be included in any of the loops, I think. But I'm thinking... Oh! It might be, like... We go two... Three... Four, five, six, and back. I think it's like that. It's like a little star. It's like a little star. It's like there's... That's the shape I need to make. Successful visualization. That's really messy, but... Yeah, that's the shape I need to make. Let's 
just bring that out here as well so it's like symmetrical with the five. This is the shape we need to make. We need to make like a star with a little bulb on the top. <laughs> That's our plan. That's our plan of action. Let's stick you up there for now. And we shall return to the actual game window. Right, that's the, that's what I need to make. I just need to figure out how to actually make that now. Oh, we start with... Curve like this. Hmm. Like this? Oh, 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 oh. I'm close. I'm close because oh yes this is the shape this is the shape now I just finesse it now we just make it neat make it work properly this is the shape this is this is it ha ha see Microsoft paint works every time it's beautiful here we go one two three four five six oh yes We've got it. We've got our little star with a hat on. Hold on. Did I ever make a command to hide my paint window? I don't think I did. I think I should do that. Give me a second. What I'm going to do is so that I don't have to keep tabbing in and out every time I want to hide and show the paint window. What I'm going to do is... I'm going to really quickly make a command I can use to make that happen. Because I already have it for like... I thought I already made one. But, oh no, I did it for like the pole. I did it to show and hide the poles. But I didn't make one for my paint window, so I should do that. Oh, I made one for my notepad too! I'm probably thinking of the notepad one at the moment. There we go. Well, that's easy because I can copy the notepad and just change it to paint instead. Paint. Okay, let me just test this quickly. <gasps> yes. Okay, there we go. I, c I can quickly show and hide my paint window now. <laughs> nice. Okay. Thank you for bearing with me in this brief interlude. Now we return. <laughs> but, oh, it feels like you're wishlisting a new game every time I stream. I'm glad. I'm so glad I can introduce these kind of games to people because, like, I'm still amazed at, like, how underrated Magnesium 173 is. The puzzles in that game were so good, and I just haven't heard anybody talking about it ever. So I feel like I need to talk about it more. But yeah, this game in particular, though, this one was only released today. This one's only just come out. So this is a brand new puzzle game. So that's really exciting. It's really nice to be able to check it out as soon as it's released. <laughs> but it's been such a joy to play so far. It's so chill. Even with the really difficult puzzles, I've never felt frustrated. I've just been watching the little line bloop around, having a great time. <laughs> right, what have we got here? Oh! Well, this one has handles and this one doesn't, so this is going to be the straight line one. We're going in the other direction. So yeah, it's just like this, I think. Got a little S over here, because then we go one, two, three, four, five, six. Nice! Twelve. Ooh, okay. Okay, again, this one has just the two points. This one has the handles attached. So... 
this one is going to be what goes through here. Because we have to have a little loop in there. So I think what we do is we go two. No, I need this the other way around. Because I need this to be that... then that, then this again. So it's got to be like that. Ah, oh, but I can't. It's going to have to be this way. the loop for this. No, I think it has to be the bottom, actually. I think these two go on the bottom so that I can make this loop up and around and actually hit this one twice. Because otherwise it's not going to. Otherwise it's not going to actually get that. But this way it will. Four. So it's going to have to go the other way around. So we go four and then we go one. Two, three, four. This will do it. One, two, three, four. Yes. Yes, it's all about the order. <laughs> now you're thinking with portals. Also, isn't it so interesting how... It's like the, the orange and blue or like orange and purple. I feel like they, they work so well for like a portal system. Like, I, you never see, like, a green portal going into, like, a pink portal or something. It's it's always, like, the, the bluish tint and then the orangish tint. Like, I feel like people just default to that for portals. And it makes sense because people understand it. Like, you come out of the, the orange portal, you go into the, the blue portal. <laughs> I love it. Also, thank you for the hydrate, Akira. I will have a sip of my drink. Actually, I will have eight sips of my drink because you did the eight redeem as well. No, I'm just kidding. I don't think I could do that. <laughs> Not with monster. I don't think I could have eight sips of monster constantly. It's a gentle sipping one. Anyway, here we've got another two. This is another one that needs to be hit twice. Eight tiny sips. Oh, I could do that. Just a little bit. Tiny bit at a time. Four. Five. Six, and then I had two sips earlier, so that is eight sips. <laughs> Thank you for the hydrate. <laughs> <laughs> oh, what a beautifully timed snake laugh, too. Thank you. Thank you. But yeah, this game is... It's so much more complex than I was expecting it to be. It's amazing how much you can do just with, like, curves and lines. And dots. And big blobs of doom. But yeah, this one is a straight line again. This one has the two curve points, so this is going to be how we get this one. I'm thinking, like, something like... Hmm, how do I want to do this? I was thinking like this kind of curve. But I only have two anchor points, which makes it a little awkward as well. Like, that would work to hit it twice, but then all I have is a straight line. I need to hit all of these points. So, oh, maybe... Maybe I go really big and hit all of these. I can't go big. I can't go big enough for what I want to do. Hmm. 
right, because the fact that the one, two, and three are here as well, I, I will need to curve to reach those in the first place. I can't even curve that far. Like, if I do this, unless I move this way more, I can't curve enough to reach the two. Oh, I guess maybe? If I do it like... Hmm. I, I really do need to hit this. Actually, let's do it. Let's do this. I'm actually going to just ignore the two for now. Just to see if I can do something like this. Then it's like I think I like this. <laughs> if I could figure out a way to start this from the three and also reach the one. <gasps> oh, I think I could. I just make these huge. If I just make oh I can't make the loops huge. Ah. Oh. I wish I could make these loops as huge as I want them to be. Unless I just do a massive... Oh, I can do a massive curve! <gasps> That's it! That's it! I just do a massive curve instead. Other way around. So we go this way. We go one, two, three. <gasps> it works! It works! The massive curve! I love that! I made a trident. I made a fork. Let's do this one. The monster's helping. All right, we've got another straight line as well, so I don't know where the straight line will be. Probably two to three. Two to three can be the straight line, and then if I can figure out a way to wiggle. Yeah, I can just go around. Like that. I think that'll do it. One, two, three, four. Oh no, I need this twice. Ah, I forgot I need that one twice. Uh, what if I do... S. S. One, two, three, four. Yes, the S. The S does it. Oh, no, it's more like a Z. It's a Z now. Hee 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 hee. One. So I need to hit that, then the one, then that. Oh, they all need to be hit twice. Ah. No, I'm not hitting these twice then. Because I can go across, I can just go across like that to hit these twice. But this one, this one needs another. Like this, but then I still need to hit the one as well. <laughs> I could figure out a way to make this work whilst also hitting the one. to work with. Oh, I 
actually hold on, I'm move this out of the way. What if what if this straight up and down for here? To so go because we can just hit this before we go in to the portal. And then if we can like bring it back back and forth like this, like stretch it out a bit. Have it so it goes through it twice. because I hit the two again. Ah. Uh, just do it like that. Yes, that works. <gasps> yeah. Oh, look at that. Look at that. Check that out. I made him work. Oh, unofficial pillow fight, but it's just you because your rays weren't working off. <laughs> Welcome in, Pillow Fort! Thank you! I love the thought of you, like, just bursting down the door with a single pillow in your hand, just being like, Pillow Fight! It's just me. <laughs> come on in, come on in. We're, we're not fighting here, but if you have a pillow, you can put it on the ground and settle down and get comfy, because we're playing a really cool, comfy, relaxing game today. <laughs> but welcome in! Lovely to see you! Welcome, welcome. I'm playing a game at the moment that just came out today. It's called Oros, and it's basically about drawing lines and curves to connect points in the right order, and this game is so charming. It is such a lovely puzzle game. It's got actually genuinely difficult puzzles in it as well. Like, it's it's more complex than I thought it would be. It's It's got trickier things than I expected when I went into it. And I'm living for it. I love it. Right, I think this is a... A loop... A loop situation. Like this. I use this to get the first and the second, whilst also going around the edge of the... The blob of doom. Like that. Like that, but look how pretty it is. Look how pretty this game is. It's so, it's so, like, everything about it is so calming and relaxing. I love it. Right, well, here we go. We've got the one and the two, and then I, I literally just do a line here to connect these ones. So we go one two. And we got them all. That was a nice one. Oh, there's actually an old drawing you had commissioned that's you carrying a single pillow, but it looks like the, this is the hill I die on pose. I love that. I love that. It's okay. You wield that pillow. <laughs> but uh, thank you for, for heading over as well. I hope you had a good stream. Uh, were you- hold on, were you playing Chicory today? I'm trying to remember, I, I feel like I saw you mention, but I don't know if I'm misremembering now. <laughs> you were! Oh, I'm glad I didn't misremember. <laughs> I usually do, my memory's... interesting. Oh, this is just gonna be- I- I used the line to just go through them twice, but then the rest is just- I just make a curve. I like this level already, it's an easier one. I just make my curve. Oh, if I can. Ooh. Actually, it's... I, I can't bring the... The points up enough. Hmm. Do I do it like this? How do I reach the two as well, then? Ooh. Never mind. I just immediately said this one is easy. Uh, just kidding. It's not. <laughs> Oh, I do the curve in a different direction, I think. I, I was trying to go up and around like that. I think I can instead go... more like an S like that way. I think it might be more like that. It's more like... 
More like that. Yes, this is the shape. This is the curve I need. This is the curve I need, and it's gonna look so pretty. Watch this. One. Two. We got them all. Oh, and it's so pretty too. It's, it's just always so nice seeing the solution after doing the puzzle as well, and it's so pretty. <laughs> oh. Oh, is your current series play? Yes, I hope you're having fun with it. I hope you had a good time. I know the music is so soothing. Gonna go to your bed computer and hang out while you pseudo nap. That sounds like a great plan to me. But yeah, thank you for stopping in though. I, I hope you have a lovely lurk. Honestly, this game is so relaxing. It's so comfy. It's the perfect thing to have on in the background while you try and rest. All right, we've got these ones that need to be hit twice. Oh, I think I can do a little like curve loop here. I think if I do like this kind of loop and hit this twice, like this. No, I'm not gonna have enough for the three to four. I need to hit these two more. Oh, I just make the loop bigger. I just make the loop bigger and I can go through all of them. I think this might do it. I'm going the wrong way, but like this. One, two, three, four. Yes, it worked. Haha. -ha. I love the moment there of just, oh, but how do I hit these two as well? I just make the loop bigger. Oh, this is a four. This is four. I gotta hit this four times. Okay. Okay, I can do this. We go one. Hmm. How do I hit this four times? How do I hit this four times? Wow. Oh, this kind of back and forth, maybe? Yeah, I think maybe, okay, doing that, I can get it three times, yes. And then I just go three, four, and I can hit it a fourth time. There we go, never mind, I thought it was hard, but I got it. We have a little scribble in the middle. Ah, oh, but Chicory's the kind of game that I've been seeing a lot of other people play, and I think I would enjoy it as well. I just always get distracted by other games. There's so many games. Right. See, a part of me here is now like, do I just go one, two, three, four? And then I just use this to, to fill these out, I think. I think I do. I think I go up here. And then I come... And... And I go here, and I do my scribble. Oh no, I'm not hitting this enough. I need... Oh. Loop. Loop, loop, loop. Loop, there we go. Okay, that's a little... No? Oh, it's one, two, three, four. Never mind. I was going one, two, four, three. I was like, I can just do that in a straight line. Just kidding. Haha. <laughs> just kidding. I'm so silly sometimes. Hee <laughs> hee. But it, I, I can still work from this, though. I think I, I do just go like one, two, all the way along to here. And then we'll go into the three, four and get the rest of these.
by doing the little zigzag back and forth into here onto the last one okay I've, I've slightly missed now that I think this might do it one two three four no I need one more for that middle one I'm missing it with one one two three yeah I'm only getting it three times I need one more hmm Still missing one here. I need one more loop. And oh, Grace, no, hello. Summoned by someone men mentioning chicory. I I approve. <laughs> Welcome in. How's it going? Happy Wednesday. I hope you're doing well. Sorry, I, I I've started getting like super focused on this one just because like I need a single point. But welcome, welcome. I hope you're doing well. Honestly, it's the kind of game I think I would enjoy if I played it. I just have so many, so many games. How can I get another? I think I may have to do the zigzag. I think the zigzag will do it if I do the zigzag big enough, like this. This should do it. Yes! No! I. How did I miss? Oh, that's three? I didn't realize that was a three. Okay, so we just bring the zigzag back further. <laughs> okay. That one's also a three. We bring the zigzag down further. Here we go. This should do it. This should do it. One, two, three, four. We go boop, 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 boop. We keep going back so we can hit them all. We've got our little scribble line in the middle. It worked! Yay! <laughs> Had a great but exhausting work day. Oh, I'm glad you can relax now. And yeah, get get back down to get away from work so you can stop thinking about the exhausting work day. <laughs> a good way to unwind. Honestly, this is a really relaxing game. It's such a comfy time and it's literally just released today, like a couple of hours ago. So this is like the newest puzzle game at the moment, I think, possibly, unless a sneaky one has just released. <laughs> but yeah, I was very kindly offered a free game key to play this game. And I feel bad now because I really like it, so I'm just going to buy it again and end up doing like... I might do like a giveaway or something. So someone else can play the game. Maybe next week, we'll see. But I, I am going to just buy the game myself. <laughs> I'm really bad at getting free games. I, I always get a free game and then I enjoy it so much that I feel bad for not having paid for it and I go and pay for it. <laughs> but I really love supporting people, especially indie devs as well, because I'm pretty sure this was made by just one person. Right, let's move these out the way to begin with. What am I working with here? We've got line with two points, line with just straight line. So we go one, two, three. This has to go through three times. Two, one. Okay. Doing that feels like a really good idea. So then from there, we'd go to the two. Where we could maybe... Yes. Yes, I think I know. Yes, that's it. This is the curve. Oh, this line's the wrong way around. But yes, this is the curve. We go like this. Ha ha! We go one. Oh, it's going the wrong way. Okay. So we go one, two, three. And we go like that. Straight line, your beloved. I, I'm not usually straight, but you know, and 
Honestly, I, I love thinking this through with the straight lines, too. Okay, oh, we got a third portal now. Okay, so if we go one, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six. We got them! So we've got three portal colors. I guess that's why the, the portal was purple and not blue, because then it meant we could get the green in without it being too similar to anything else. But, oh, this is so cool. I This is so pretty. Oh, this is all straight lines too. So I need to figure out how to hit all of these twice. Oh, I think it's just going to be straight line, straight line, straight line. So we'll start here. We'll go one... to here two like that I think this should work one two yeah it did work um that shape may be a little less satisfying than some of the shapes we've had so far I don't know why it just made me think of uh you know, like, in horror movies when it's like they're out in the forest and there's, like, bundles of twigs together to indicate that cult things are happening or, like, things like that? It kind of reminds me of that shape. Ah. <laughs> uh, I've never seen so many straight things on my stream before, right? It's so funny, though, because before this, there were not any straight lines. It's only in, like, this chapter that the straight lines have started being part of the puzzles. Because all of it so far has been about curves. And keeping the curves going. But now it's... Ooh. Okay, so that... Ha oh. I know how to do this. Okay, so we start with one. And we go here. We go... This goes one, two, three. Go back here and go one, two, three again. And then we go here into the end. So it's going to go like this. Watch this. We go one, and then we go back, and we go back, and we go back. Oh no, I didn't go back far enough. For... Uh, no, not that one. This one. There. This should do it. I love the sounds so much. <laughs> the little bloops are so, so calming. And maybe not that so. <laughs> I love the thought of me being like, oh, this is so calming and nice and relaxing. Vine boom. <laughs> Vaughn. Jim. Eight. All right, let's try this. Oh, we're back to the curves now. Here we go. Okay, the straight lines are, whoa. There's a portal in the- oh my goodness. There's a portal in the circles. Okay, so we go one, two. We come out here. Oh no, I'm going the wrong way around. That way around. This. One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six. Is that way around? Yes. One, two, three, four, five, six. Oh, now we have curves with portals embedded in them. This is going to be interesting. Okay, so we start. Oh, these have to be gotten like this. So I guess I guess I can just do this like this. Like that to make sure they're in the right order. Also, Avas to the second. Welcome, welcome! Welcome on in. Thank you for the follow. How's it going? 
Welcome to Puzzle Game Times. I think this should do it. So we go one, two, three. Get all of them, and we've got the loop. No? Why is that one not working? I went through it. Oh, I was just a bit too close, I think. I was a bit too close there. I, I think I was just clipping it from the wrong side so it was going through it twice, possibly. Oh, you're horrible. Oh, I hope you feel better soon. Hopefully joining a calm stream will help. Oh, the these ones have to be gotten twice. Ooh. How do I get these twice? Oh, it's, I know how I do this. I do this like this. Do this like this. Also, I'm sorry if you're having a horrible time, but please read the stream rules. This isn't a place for for talking about negativity i'm sorry if you if you're having a bad day and you want a calm place to to hang out and rewind a uh, rewind re rewind relax and just like recuperate this is the place for that but uh please don't talk about everything awful going on i'm i'm sorry things are bad for you but not the place to talk about it sorry <laughs> but if you want to look at a really cool puzzle game this is this game is so charming. Yeah, I need to do like a... I don't think there's a way I can do an... Like a loop, loop-de-loop. -loop. I wanted to do like a, a break in the curve, but because I only have the three points, I don't think I can do that. Oh, I can hit two of them like this. And then I guess I can also hit the other two this oh oh I think it might be like this maybe I think I do it the other way around I think I do it sides I think I do one on one side and then the other on the other side and maybe no because ideally I need to hit all of them how do I hit all of them do I make it long <gasps> I make it long oh I make it long that's what I do that is what I do. Also, oh my goodness, we've got a raid! Celerity Dust, hello! Welcome, welcome! Thank you for the raid! Come on in! Welcome! How did it go? How was your stream? What were you doing? Come on in! Welcome to Comfy Puzzle Times. I am playing the, the most relaxing puzzle game at the moment. This game just got released today and it is so calming and relaxing. It's so nice. Ah, oh, a, a touch of an emergency raid. Started feeling ill on stream. Oh no. Oh, I hope you feel better soon. Yeah, if you want to, if you want to de-stress and relax, uh, come on in. Come on in. There, there are bean bags. Pull up a chair. Come and settle down. But thank you for bringing the raid this way. I really hope you feel better soon. But oh, I, I'm, I'm so glad you think so. <laughs> but yes, welcome on in. Welcome in, Raiders! To anyone who's new here, hello! I'm Liri, I'm a pink-haired cat girl from the UK, and I love comfy games and puzzle games, and today I've got both. I've got both in one. Usually I have to make a disclaimer, like, this is a puzzle game, but it's not very comfy. Or I'll be like, this is a really comfy game, but there's no puzzles. But this time I've, I've actually hit the jackpot. I've found the comfiest puzzle game. This game is so chill and relaxing I'm I've been having so much fun playing it it's so fun but yeah I'm playing a game at the moment called Oros it only came out today it came out like a couple of hours ago on Steam and it is such a nice game oh I missed them I missed one and the basic premise of the game is you have 
lines and spirals and shapes, and you just have to hit all of the points in order. Which seems really simple to begin with, but I'm I'm in the, the later levels now, so they're they're getting quite complex. But if if you look at like some of the first levels, if I go back to just like here, you'll see we've got like one, two, three, and then we've got these points that can be hit in any order. And what you do is you just move the little handles around until it lines up and it goes through all of the all of the dots in order. And you make like a little shape and it's so, so nice. It's such a pretty game. It's got like such a lovely soundtrack and beautiful graphics. Like the colors are so nice. And I've just been having so much fun playing it. Like it's introduced so many more mechanics. Like it's started adding portals now, which adds another level to things. Oh, why is it why is it 135246? How do I hold on? No, I know how to do this. I have a really little circle in the middle just for three and six. Other way around. No, that doesn't quite work. Oh, five, six, one. Five, six, one. Two, three, four. So I need the portal to be near five. Okay, so for this one, I think what I do is I overlap them like in the middle, like a Venn diagram. Like that. Also, Lyrical Nix, thank you. I'm glad you like my voice. <laughs> thank you so much. I've had a lot of people say I have a very calming voice, which I like. <laughs> yeah, one, it comes out of the orange portal and we can go two, three, four. Five, six, one, two, three, four, five, six. They're a little wobbly. That's a little squashed, but it worked. <laughs> but yeah, this game is just so nice. I actually feel really lucky because I, I, I got a promotional email from like, I'm guessing like marketing for the, the developer offering me a free, a free code for this game. But now that I'm playing it, I'm just like, well, I'm I'm simply going to buy the game. Because I I feel bad getting this game for free. I really like it. <laughs> I really like it. I want to support it. Okay. I need to hit this four times. How do I get it four times? What if I put the portal on it? Okay, if I put the portal on it, then it counts both portals, like going in and out. So I think I can just maybe do this. One, two. No, I need to give it a bit more time. Ba -ba -ba. So I think something like Something like this should work. Just overlap it a little bit. Yes! Yeah, that works! We keep looping them. And now we do this one. Ooh! Hold on, I think for this one I could... I can literally just like do a circle like that and then for the next one I just do another circle but I just don't include the one like I just include the these ones like 
like that. I think this will work. No, I, what did I miss? Oh, it's going through it twice. I need the portal to be in between them. Okay. It's okay. I just wiggle slightly. That should be okay. Let's try. One, two, three. Oh no, now it's not hitting it. There. There, this should do it. One. Two, yes. Bringing it around. Oh, look at it though. That's so pretty. I bet if I'd... I bet if I'd made that a bit neater, it would make like a really nice symmetrical pattern. <laughs> But I made it work. Right, oh, okay, this, we've got a loop and we've got a curve. So the loop's gonna have to go over this side. I think. So we go one, two, three. five with the curve. One, two, three, four, five. Yeah, got him. Ha ha. There are so many levels here. The Okay, yeah, that that was the tutorial for loop and curve portals and how they work. Okay, circle's gonna have to be here. Portal goes here. Like that. Three, four, five, six. So we go one, curve two. Three, four, five, six. One, two. Three, four, five, six. Hee <laughs> hee. Of. <laughs> Let's do this one. Oh, here we go. Here we go. These have to go around this way. <gasps> oh, that's really sneaky because of the five. Because it would make sense to do the four, five, six, but no, it's got to go that direction. Mmm. I think what I do is I need the portal between the three and the five. And this all goes around like this. We go like one, two, three, portal to four, then five, six. So we need to go the other way around. So we go one, two, three, portal to four. And then back to five, six. Ha ha. Oh, it looks like a little slime, like a little smiley face slime. <laughs> oh, it was cute. Right, this one, a loop and a curve. We got one, two, three, four. I think we use the loop to get through all of these. Oh yes, curve this way to go through the once, loop this way to go through the once. Okay, I see what I have to do here. How do I get this curve? Yes. Okay, yeah, that's the right shape for that. So three, four. There we go, one, two, but we bring this down so we can go through all of these points. Like that. This should do it. So we go one, two, three. Oh, it didn't hit the three. I, I need to... I need to adjust this slightly so that the, the portal is before the three. <laughs> oops, oops, oops. It's okay. Yeah. 
Okay, that should do it. One, two, three, four. Got them all. What shape is that like? I can't think of anything that one's like. Every time I make one, I'm, I feel like a little part of me is just thinking of like, you know when you look at clouds and you try and see shapes in the clouds? It's what I'm trying to do with the, the solutions to these puzzles. Like I'll look at it and be like, oh, that looks like a sheep. That one's a fish. That's the Nike logo. <laughs> right, so we got one. Oh, why is the two up there? So we're going two, three, four, five. I think two, three, four, five is the the loop. I think we loop around this way. Like this, we've got our little egg going around. Two, three, four, five. And then we start one. And we do our curve to hit that. Two, three, four, five. Yes, this should do it. So we go one, two, three, four, five. And we go through that twice. Oh, see, that one's a little mushroom. Or a dandelion. Or a jellyfish with a single tentacle. <laughs> right, what do we have here? That This is all alone. So this is gonna be one, two. I think that's gotta be one, two, because this is trapped off by everything else. And then we go three, four, five, six. Oh, but yeah, I need to do that. I need a curve. I think I think I just got it, but I think this should do it. But thank you for the posture check and hydrate. I did do it. And we have a big stretch and sit up straight and I will have a sip of my monster. Thank you. This game is so great. Wait, what time is it? It's 5.30. I've got 20 minutes. I wonder if I can finish this area in the last one. Before 6. Let's see how smart I am. <laughs> ah, okay. I think this one is... We do a loop for the 2, and then the 1 is like a straight line. Oh no, I need to hit all of them twice. How do I do that? Oh, I have enough points for this one to to do a woobly like this. So I'll use this for one of the points and then the other point I can't reach with my woobly, I will use the straight line. Mm -hmm. I can hit all of them once like this. I wanted to hit them twice. Ideally, I would really like this overlap to be like here. So I hit that twice. Ah, oh, but I'm just I'm just not hitting any of the numbers here. How do I do this? Oh well, there's the portal start. I wonder if I just do the loop like one, two, like, no, this. I need some loops in here. There's no way I'm doing this without loops. This is not gonna work without loops. Do I do a loop from one to two maybe? Might work. Ooh, ooh. Oh, actually maybe just doing a circle like this. Like, I say a circle, it's more like a... I don't know what kind of shape I've made here. Like an alien face. <laughs> an alien with a really pointy chin. <laughs> Larry speedrunning. Oh, I'm not speedrunning, though. This It's only a short game anyway. It, it had an estimated playtime of two to four hours. 
but because I'm a, a very easily distracted person, I was like, well, it's going to be like closer to the four hour mark for me. But uh, I think I can do it, though. Hmm. Oh, I think if I do it like this, I can hit both of these once and then hit this one twice. Yes, it hits that twice, so then I can just do the straight line across like this. And this will work! Watch this, we go... One... Two... Three. Ha ha ha! Got him! I did it! Okay, uh... One, two... Three, four, five... Oh, there's, there's so much back and forth! But there's also this in the middle, so... What if... Oh, I think this is where I want the portal. Swap these over. There. I think I want the portal between five... Yeah, because five is the last one. So I can then go five, one, two. And then once I'm out of the portal, it will become three, four. Oh, this is a straight line one. No, I have to do the loop like this. I have to do the loop for the three and the four. Because otherwise, there's no way I'm hitting those points. So I think, yeah, I think I do it like this. And then it's just the... Okay, so then it's the one, two. I think this will work. So we go one, two, three, four, five, and we hit it three times. Yes! Oh, that's a really pretty one to look at, too. <laughs> the pretty solutions. Ooh, this is three. This is a three, so I need to hit it twice with these. So I'm thinking this is a simple back and forth. Very narrow back and forth, so I go between them all. So I go through them all twice. three times. Like that. It's so hard to make out like this. It's so hard to see what's going on. Oh, I didn't hit the one. I didn't reach the one like this. Hold on. Oh, it's because of the portal. Because the portal is... I need to bring that down to like here. Okay, this should work. One, two, yes. Oh, that's really pretty too. You've just got like the line in the middle and then it's going around it. Like the eye of a needle. I love that. Right, this one. Okay, we got one, two, three, four, five. And the one has to go that way. And three has to go that way. Okay. I think I do a loop for one, two, three, and then just do straight line for four and five. Because I think if I'm doing a circle here, I'll be able to go through all of these as well. Where do I need the portal to be, though? Ooh. Yeah, because I can go... One, hit that. Two. Three. Yes, that's the shape. That's the shape. And it goes through all the points it needs to. And then I just go four, five. Isn't that way? Yes. 
one, two. Oh no, I need the portal to be here. I just, I just need to swap these over. Swap these. I need the portal to be between these. But this should work. Okay, let's try. Here we go. One. No, hold on. No, the portal needs to be this one up here. Oh goodness. Okay, so I move them all along one. So this goes here. This goes here. This goes here. This goes here. Okay. Okay, I got it. I got it. We're fine. Whew. That's where the portal needs to be. Here. Other way around, though. One, two... No, hold on. No, it, it was where these other ones were. Okay, hold on. No, I need to... I need to move them back all around again. You go there, you go there, you go there, you go here. It was just going in the wrong direction. I had to reverse it. But now we go one, two, three. <laughs> Sw I can swap that over easier. There, we got it, we got it. One, two, three, four, five. Oh, oh it's the ordering that's messing me up now. <laughs> But we did it! We've completed area 10! Let's see how big area 11 is. Can I do this in 15 minutes? <laughs> um, I will try my best. One, two, three, four. This is just... Wibble around. This is wobbling back and forth. to the DNA part. <laughs> DNA strand. I got it. Oh, goodness. Where do I start? I'm going to start top left. Uh, <laughs> I only have to do two of these to unlock the next branch, but I do want to do them all. Okay. A loop and a curve and a straight line. Fabulous. Right, well, the loop and the curve are going to be used to get these. So, I will start, how will I start? Oh, I think actually I can go all the way up to three. I don't want this to be where the point is. Where the portal is, there we go. Okay, we've got a portal in here. Right, how do I get all of these again? I think it's gonna be two. Right, because this connects to both of these. So if we start with one here. goes into here, which could then do the two. Oh, it's, it's actually hard to make a curve that works like this. So that goes one, two, three, but it only goes through that one once. So we start the curve here. Ha! Ah, yes! This should do it. One, two, three. And it goes through them all twice. Yes. Nice. Now we do this one. 
One, two, three, four. Yeah, I think this is a... Like this. Like this, I think we go one, two. Then we go into the portal here and we go three, four. Three, four, I think this should do it. I think that should do it. One. Oh no, I moved it too late. Oh no, it's clipping the, there. This should do it. Also, Leova, hello! Thank you for the follow! Welcome, welcome! Welcome on in! Welcome to beautiful puzzles! <laughs> I'm doing the other one because I cannot be stopped. I have one, two, three, four, five, six. Oh, they're so back and forth! But we do have two eggs in a line, so... Four, five, six should be easy enough to just go around. Kind of like this. Four, five, six. That feels right for these ones, I think. Yeah, four, five, six. Ah, oh, unless I need it to be the other one, because this is the straight line. Where do, where do I want the straight line to be? Well, I think the straight line is just going to be forgetting these twice. Like that. So then we start on the blue side to go... One, two, three. Oh, but that's gonna go through that another time. Ooh. This is tricky because ideally I don't want to go through this one a second time. Oh no, I do. I want to go through both of these. Never mind. I'm, I'm silly. <laughs> we go like this. I think this should do it. One. Oh no. Hold on. Other way around. One, two, three. Oh, this is the wrong way. I just swapped these two. This should do it. One, two, three, four, five, six. And it goes through them all twice. We got them. Nice. But, oh, beautiful indeed. It's so comfy, isn't it? It is such a comfy game. It's so, it's so relaxing to play as well. There's something really calming about it. I feel like the sound effects help a lot with that too. So we've got one, two, three, four. Wait, do I just do it like this? I think I just do it like this. I just use the the points to make it more square. Yeah, I just do it like that. One, two, three, four. I've just made a rounded corners rectangle. How about this one? Oh, it's giving me more points now. It's basically saying, hey, you can make like... Very severe angles now. Like, if I go like this... I've only got six points here. Seven? Oh, seven points. Oh, okay. Interesting. I think this is a curve situation. I think this is a loop. We make a loop. And then we make another loop. Yeah, I think we just make loops here. Lots of loops. loop and then we loop 
Oh, but it's two I need next. to here. Oh no, and then we, we just loop here. Oh, and then we need to loop up to the top as well. I've, I'm using too many points for these loops, I think. bring a point up here. Yes. I can finesse this. I can make these curves work better. <laughs> yeah, I think it's something like this. I just need to figure out where to anchor them all. <laughs> Yes. Yes. I think I got it. One, two, three, four. Yep. I got it. I love these loops. They're such satisfying loops to look at. Right, one, two, three. Four, five, six. I think what we've got to work with here is like some slightly more drastic loops up to like four and five, like this. Like these kind of loops. work better. Can make this work better. Okay, they're like five, six. And then like around to one, two, three. It's gonna be like these kind of loops. Oh, look at this. Look how pretty it's looking. I think it's this. I just need to make sure that everything's in the spot it should be. Yes, like that. Watch this. Oh, it's backwards. One, two, three, four, five, six. And the loops, the, I love the way they just go around. It's it's so flowy, it's so nice. All right, let's do this now. There's four on the side, oh goodness. One, two, three, four, five, six. Got the the one and the four are gonna need little loops, so I think bringing something around like this. And then I need to bring it down for like the three as well. And then around to the four. So this. Two, three. Four. Five, six, like this. Yes, oh, this is it, this is the shape. This is the shape, I just gotta finesse it. We got like these little, this little shape in the middle. I, and now I just, if we just make these loops bigger, yes. Yes, there it is. Okay, one. Oh no, it's the wrong way. Here. We go one, two, three, four, five, six. Yes. 
I got it. That's a really cool shape. It kind of reminds me of Cat's Cradle. Like getting a piece of string doing like the Cat's Cradle with your hands. Like, it's, it's that kind of crisscross line work. <laughs> oh, goodness me. One, two, ah. Uh. One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay, I see the I see the shape in my mind. Let's see if we can make it. track of which ones I need to move. Like, really bad at the, the curve drawing aspect of this. Okay. Oh, that, that made the... Okay, this is this one. I think this might be a paint situation too. Oh, it's already six. No, I really wanted to finish this game. I wanted to finish this game in one go. Hold on, what I'm gonna do is, um, I let's see if I can at least like do like two from each branch very quickly. See which ones I can figure out easiest. Start with like two, three, Six, seven. Right. That didn't work. It's just getting to the seven then. So we'd have to like keep going around. No, I think I'm actually getting to the point where I, d I don't think I can finish the game in one go. Oh, I'll have to just do a stream next week where like I, I finish off this and then maybe maybe finish off another couple puzzle games that I haven't finished because I think there are still a couple. Uh, I know that uh, Cats in Time has had a a couple of levels since I last played it, so I can do that. But yes, I'm I'm definitely coming back to this game because I do want to finish it. If I hadn't like taken a break to look at pottery, I think I would have been able to do it all in one go. But I've <laughs> but I I gotta head off now. I gotta go get some dinner and get some rest. Oh, that's such a shame. I feel like I'm so close. There's like seven, eight nine levels left oh that's so painful but yeah i have to i have to head off wait let's just have a quick look yeah no these are like the more intricate ones this is like end game puzzles now <laughs> but yeah oh do it next wednesday and i can call it wrap up wednesday you're a genius you're a genius i can do that <laughs> but yeah i think i have to leave it at that for now i'm i gotta head off also my brain is falling apart but this game is so cool. This has been so fun to play. Right, with that I shall bloop.
let's head off over to this screen and find somebody to raid. Let's see who's online. But yeah, Tiffany's gonna be mad at me too because I, I gotta feed my cat. She's gonna be so angry. She's gonna be angry. And... Hmm. Who shall I raid? I A little part of me is like, I could just raid Sylphie again because they are live. And I think it's like the last day of the Donathon, probably. Yeah, I'm, I'm gonna raid Sophie again. <laughs> I'm gonna raid Sophie again because I'm very predictable. But also because it's the... Maybe... No, okay, I think they're doing another day of the Donathon. There have been donations. <laughs> People have brought the timer up. But I'm gonna raid them anyway. Because Sylphie is also really, really cool. They're doing an art... Art at the moment? Yeah, they're doing art. They're doing art of, like, the the fan uh, flockers. <laughs> Sylphie's flockers. They're drawing people as, as the mascot design. So that seems like a really comfy place to send you over to. Sylphie is an amazing artist. Lovely friend. Lovely person. No, it's not Too Fault Tuesday. Hold on. Hold on. That's wrong. Hold on. It's not that message. I forgot to change that. Uh, ha, ha. Let me try that again. Uh, here's the raid message. It's not twofold Tuesday until next Tuesday, unfortunately. But here's the raid message. We'll use the comfy emote if you're subbed, and if not, we will send hearts. And I'm going to send you over to Sylphie. But yeah, this game has been... So no, please don't send the, tu the Tuesday raid message, because it... it, it I, I already sent that message literally to Sylphie yesterday. <laughs> Please use the normal raid message. <laughs> Thank you. But yes, with that, I shall head off and go and get some dinner. Go get some rest. And I'll be back again on Friday for some more Divinity with Xander. And hopefully this time we will have a little bit more of an idea of what we're doing. We're going to start by just desperately trying to find party members. And then hopefully we can do fights and do silly things. I've been collecting so many vials of oil. I think we can cause shenanigans with them. I'm excited. But yes, that'll be Friday. So I'm going to head off for now. And I hope everyone has a lovely rest of the week. Thank you so much, everyone, for joining me today. This game has been really, really fun. I'm, I'm a little sad I couldn't do it all in one stream, but I... I can feel myself flagging a bit. I think I I need a little break before I try all the hard puzzles. But I'll do that next week. I'll make it make it work. I'll do like a puzzle finishing stream. But yes, thank you so much everyone for joining me today. And until next time, bye-bye!